<laughs> oh, my phone's being slow. Sorry. Hold on, let me wait. Switch account. Oh, wait, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Cycle sticks. Hold on, let me do something. Hey, Swarm. I'm just getting everything set up. My uh, streams start at 10 o'clock. Yeah. I think you were like, a, I think if you're who I think it was, yeah. Yeah. Zenith. That's what it was. Yeah. You're about an hour, hour early. Let's see. Let's see. I'm almost ready. I gotta, I almost, I gotta like do some stuff. Go live. Manage. Hi, Chroma. Yeah, I checked Discord today. Um, I don't usually talk too much on Discord. Uh, but I do check it every morning. Uh, let's see. So, I gotta, I gotta update this. Oh. I do have a, I do have my Discord, but it's stuff like that. But yeah, check general. Oh, general. Hold on, let me, let me check that. I didn't check it. I didn't check it after a while. Hold on, Warframe. Okay, no thingy. Okay, let's see. Um, let's check general. Da da da. Which general got? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a schedule for um deck stuff. Okay, so I, I, I see you. You want to know what dex is? Hey, so, uh, hold on, let me close this. So, yeah, yeah, Dex is, um, Dex is basically, uh, the stuff for, uh, what you call, anniversary. Usually pretty good gear, to be completely honest. There we go, we're ready. But it's, it's actually really good gear. Um, not the best, because the best is usually, like, depends on the weapon. Uh, and depends on your playstyle. But dex gear is really good. The skins are just skins, but if it's a weapon, it's going to be an actual weapon. They attack us in the very, yeah, yeah. Oh, dex! Oh, you're talking about, like, who the dex are. So, the, the dex. So, dex is the um like dexterity i guess uh or dexterous or something like that but um uh yeah, yeah, yeah. oh yeah the legendary 3 video but yeah um so the dex but dax d a x is the um people you're talking about the dax are different and let me see if let me see if this, if i got that right because i need to see the spelling of dex because dex is more like dexterity yeah de dexterity like dex um but dax are the people who trained us while we were slaves for the Orokin. Um, they had the Dax watch over us and train us, and also make sure that they punished us when we weren't, when we, when we weren't doing what they want us to do. Uh, Teshin is a Dax, but he is one of the few who had sympathy for us. In any part of the game where we play as Teshin or something, I saw something like that when I was playing not owning a PC. Uh, that would be the new war. The new war is a mission that's in the future. Um, you play as them for a little bit, but you don't get to play with him again. 
there's three characters and there's essentially like a spoiler for that. So I won't go too far into it, but you do get to play as Teshian. Uh, for a little bit. Mm. And then nice stuff happens. Let's see, you don't get to play him for long. Yeah, you don't get to play him for long. Only for like a little bit. What's the machine beside the relic? Let me see this one. Uh, that that's a uh, that's the void brace. Oh, you mean this one? This one's for for mechanical pets, I think. I think you're talking about the mechanical pet one, or right here uh, up below the relic. That's the machine that you do with the relics. Yeah. So basically, like sentinels go there. Actually, I don't, well, I don't think I have a sentinel equipped. Oh, I have nugget equipped. So, in order to show that, I would have to have a MOA equipped or something. Yeah. And you click your MOA, that's where that goes. Or a Sentinel. Or, what's, what else goes there? A Hound. Rocket. I haven't used Rocket in a while. I'm actually considering using Rocket. Um, I don't think anything else goes there. Because anything alive goes here. This is where the pets sleep. Go. Uh, and then you also got the jelly. We're getting cavat segments too. Yeah, the cavat segments are a thing. Uh, those, that's like for a, that's like a, how do I say this? That's available already. It's just that newer players would like to have like a better way to get it. There's two ways you can get it. You can either get it from the dojo or you can get it from the Hayeka mothers or Hayeka masters I mean the Hayeka masters have them okay let's see I think I yeah I wanted to play with kit guns today I have oh yeah I have a kit gun that I wanted to make uh but first I need to I need to do some house cleaning Inventory. Weapons. Okay, we're gonna clean up this. Because there's a few weapons that I actually don't want. Oh yeah, Baza can go. That's the regular Baza, not the Baza Prime. I know I know some YouTubers like to keep multiple the same weapon, but I like to keep the best one instead. Umber Forma 2. Yeah, okay. yeah Umber Forma is good. We're getting Umberforma, and actually a lot of my builds have Umberforma on them. Uh, because I tend to use Umber mods a lot. In fact, I have very expensive builds. Like, a lot of them require a lot of shit. <laughs> a lot of my builds are just so packed with shit. Uh, what else? You know what it does? So there's three, uh, actually there's technically five, but there's five special mods called Umber mods that the more of them you have on, the more powerful it makes each one. It's really good for increasing your strength really high, as well as your armor and your health. Yeah. Yeah, the Umber, and yeah, and that gives the Umber polarity. It has a unique polarity called Umbra, and... That's what you use that for. Angst oh, I didn't level that up. Uh, Angstrom. Dorklov. It's good on tank DPS frames. Yeah, it is. Do I need the gazelle for anything? I don't think I need a gazelle for anything. But I'm not sure. I need the high Q for something like... I think I need the Hikau for a certain weapon. But I also need like another weapon as well. So, yeah. Sayandana. Will I do relics? Yeah, I'm probably going to be doing relics. Uh, there's a few relics I think I might need to use. And also I think, you, I think a couple people were wanting to do relics with me. So I'll be doing some relics. Sero. Oh, no, not yet. Sycorus can go. Uh, 
If you're down, I can invite you. Yeah, that sounds good. Yeah, you guys can join me. I'm not sure if we're going to be doing like really high level stuff, but I know we're going to be doing something. Oh, also the Velox. There's going to be a Velox Prime. So I think I should preemptively get rid of this. Uh, what else? Simos can stay. It's funny. It's unique enough to stay. Lotto. Oh, did I ever? I don't think I maxed out the Lotto. Never mind. I don't think I maxed out the Lotto, so I can't change out the Lotto yet. I know I had another weapon that I wanted to get rid of. I'm trying to think. Oh, yeah, Endura. Yeah, definitely the Endura. I'm trying to think what weapon I wanted to get rid of, because I need to get rid of a couple of them. Wait, do you have Tatsu Prime? If yes, you show me your frame holds it. Uh, yeah, hold on. The Tatsu Prime, I think... I can show you that, the way she holds it. Um... Zuge, I can get rid of that. Uh, Agret. I'm, I'm considering getting rid of the Agret, but I don't think I want to necessarily. Oh, Oxtamod. Oh, no, it's not ready yet. Azathine. Uh, Duskana. Dukama. I, I think there's one more, but I can't find it. I know there was one more I wanted to get rid of. Also, remember correctly, I only wanted, like, a certain melee weapon, so I could get rid of Kurado. Although, I did put a potato in it. Let's see. Oh, yeah, the map. No, that's, that's not leveled yet. I didn't level a lot of melee weapons, did I? I think some melee weapons are still able to be leveled. Uh, Stug, I'll keep the Stug. Yeah, I got Tatsu Prime. Talons, yeah, I can get rid of Talons. Ne nice Neo, a new Interception just popped. Oh, nice. I like Interception. No, a lot of people don't like ne ne um, Interception, but I do. I'm weird like that. Uh, I thought there was going to be a Viper in Karnan uh, quicker than this. Because I thought they were going to keep getting some stuff, but yeah. Europe. I think Europe is... Is that infested? Europe. No, Europe, Europe is... Oh, it's, it's Corpus. Okay. It's 12 fishers, yeah. Yeah, I think it is as well. I'm also gonna. Oh, yeah, I also wanted to make a kit gun. That's what I did that for. So I'm gonna go finish. I'm gonna go make my kit gun and then I'll, I'll be with you. There's like. I actually made this kit gun and stuff. Oh, yeah. Uh, so there's also some good news. There is a chance that I might have a Tenno that I'm playing with who might want to play your rally. Yeah, for 269. Dude, that's, that's that would look so weird because they have her heads in their chest, but yeah. Friend, I wish it wasn't. Could turn it off. Grab me some peace. But no, Chatter is always right. So you are welcome, and Chatter keeps on talking! Mm, good kit gun. Why is it red? Oh, it's... Oh, sure. That's a, that's a spoiler. It's a, it's a little bit of an important spoiler, though. But it changes the way it looks uh, 
after a certain mission. Yeah. The reason why spoilers are important is because it kind of sort of is like a thing that, um... Yeah, it's kind of, it's kind of a thing that, uh, DE kind of says is probably not great. But, um, it's mostly because, like, story is the reason why the game is the way- is good, so... Yeah. Did, you, didn't, you didn't see much more? Yeah. I do have to go back there, though. There's actually a bunch of things that happen for certain reasons, which is okay to see. It's just that you can't necessarily explain what's happening. It was looking like Deimos, yeah. It's the new lighting. <laughs> there we go. Yum. Yum. Okay, let's see. Alright, so I got my stuff. Build kit gun. Toast your eyes. Yeah. No, nah, it's fine. It's fine. I think it was Tremor. And then it was a Cried. Oh, this actually looks really fucking stupid. Like, but I think it's fine. Uh. So what is the damage on this? It's 37. Oh, that's terrible. Actually, let me check something. Shrewd is lower damage or faster fire rate. Is there one that's like, not that? Let me see. Love tap? No, that's a second. That's a secondary. Secondary makes it up to 52. Cover the screen, yeah. Uh, let me see. Brash? No, Brash is not good either. Steady Slam? Nah. No, I think we're good with Tremor. Tremor, Tremor is okay. Yeah, I want this. Give me. Here you go. Just like you asked. Who said I asked? I demand as a customer. Yeah, let's see. Let's go. Equipment. Arsenal. Kit gun. Uh, primary. Where's kick gun? There we go, kick gun. And then we're gonna put this away. And put... And we're gonna put this. I know three players today while fishing. I'm so accurate. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Pop that. Actually, I, I should go with her her melee. Where is my is the not the Hesper? What, Chris? There we go. By the way, can you can you see your regarded build real quick? Uh, I think I have I have like three of them, but. I'll show you the, uh, the, the main one, since I think that's the one you're talking about. It's a really expensive build, but it's mostly because I had to do some adjustments over time. I think she comes with polarities that you don't have to worry about. Um, but, yeah. Flow, Umbro fight, uh, all three Umbro mods... Continuity, uh, adaptation, blind rage, and auger secrets. The reason why you don't want to use uh, Ronin Guard is because you're gonna. It doesn't work with Maruluna, and this is a Maruluna build. You also have preparation up here, um, but it's not necessary necessarily. Um, but it's just like actually no, actually it is because. When you pop the board, you might fat finger the keys or controller and hop off of it if you press like a melee button or something. So yeah, it's a bit similar to Chroma, more Chroma build, yeah. Also, the adaptation is unranked because of the fact that um, it only raises it to 
And because you're usually being shot a lot, then yeah. Is that song cut scene available? We change it. So, so, uh, let me see. I think, where is she? There's a, there's a person that you can talk to to activate it. Oh, where'd she go? I know she's like somewhere, but there's a person you can activate. Run past P P S S P S F. I'm not sure. I think is it like is it you you no not you. Yeah, there's there's a person you can talk to to trigger it. Is it you? No. The thing is, is I actually think um. I actually think after you get that thing, there's two guys hammering in the middle. Okay, let's see. It's not you. Is it you? Okay, not you. Is it you? No, it's not you. What I think is happening is I think they might have removed that guy. Is your rookie affected by firm sure footed? Yes, she is. Because in actuality, when she's on her board, um, she gets knocked down. She just doesn't have an animation for it. So you put Frime sure-footed on it and You're able to not get knocked down Although I don't use it because I prefer adaptation um, Yeah But if you do want to not run into an issue of being knocked down from a, a melee attack or a certain type of explosion you do probably want to use it. And I, I always prefer unranked adaptations because if you get hit with a lot of stuff, you're, you only have to get hit with twice as much. And the fact is like, um, you're going to get hit by a lot of stuff during like the shield gate part. So you're going to have a max style adaptation before you even get a, a shield gate so it's like it's not necessary to have a full one plus it's really expensive so cost effectiveness is probably to be don't have a fully maxed out one uh but yeah i'm gonna switch to my other year ready and then you can invite me i think i, I think you are inviting tatsu prime oh yeah, yeah tatsu prime tatsu Tatsu, Tatsu, Tatsu. You want to max out the kit gun for fishers? Uh, that depends on whether or not um, we're going to steal path. If we're going to steal path, we might need to. That's... it's uh, this is, It shows the guard, but I don't think it shows anything else. Because uh, I don't... I, I have all my weapons invisible. Oh, well, let me try something. Uh, condition overload, blood rush, uh, what else? I want, uh, weeping wounds, oh, let's put weeping wounds here. Uh, reach. Reach for the sky. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Berserker Fury. Tell me when you're ready, I'll invite you. Yeah. Uh, I, I gotta do one thing. Uh, I think I would like Toxin and Frost. Uh, and then, is there one last thing? I think there is one last thing. Let's do Organ Shatter. There we go. Do this, and let's do... Which time is it for me? It's 10 o'clock. 10.30. I'll put animosity. I think that'd be hilarious. But yeah, uh Yes, I I I'm ready for the invite. Mm -hmm. 
Can you join in 30 minutes? Okay. I'm ready. I can see. Alright, I'll see you in 30 minutes. Okay. Jump to 99. Run me at your, at your 11, yeah. Okay. Okay. So that I guess um will I guess because they're uh it depends on whether or not um it's steel path the interception if it's not steel path then we can go actually where's Tatsu I kind of want to bring Tatsu I know Tatsu Prime also has this cool thing where it like does a funny haha -ha. yeah I should even check uh oops uh oh yeah it's a steel path one yeah we're probably gonna need to yeah probably gonna oh what we're probably gonna... what I'll probably do is I'll switch to a different kit gun since this is literally just a kit gun thing so let's switch to a different kit gun. Uh, sun kiss or sun killer? I think I, I kind of want to do sun killer. I mean sun kiss. There we go. Different kit gun. What was that creature? Uh, I think it was the cat. Uh, let's see. A broken kettle. There we go. I think he's talking about the, uh, the cat. Uh. Uh. Oh, yeah. The that is not the cat. The Kavat. On Deimos? Oh. Hmm. I think you might be talking about... What is that thing called? Uh. Uh, I think it's called a charger. Oh no! Yeah, 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 yeah. I think you know. I know what you're talking about. The creature on Deimos. This or the Panzer Volpapida is also another one. There's Volpapidas as well. I think I have a Volpapida. Oh, I don't have a Volpapida. I did not know I didn't have a Volpapida. I'll probably get one later. But yeah, I switched to uh, a different loadout, so I should be able to go there. So I on navigation, yeah. Hmm, let's see. Navigation. Deimos. Oh, you mean where to go? This guy? Yeah, this guy, he... I think you're talking about that. Is there another one? I think there's also another one. No? Oh, okay. On this, on the map. It was purring. Oh! Okay. Lephantis. You might actually be talking about Lephantis. Not Lephantis. Uh... I know there's like, yeah. You condemn our there's like a few things that could that could be actually. Oh yeah, this one it is Levantis. Oh, I I can't see him right now because he's being covered by a different type of mission. But I think you're talking about Levantis. Yeah, Levantis is cool. Fisher. Mm. I don't think so. yeah. Da, 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 da. Oh wait a minute. This there he is. The sortie. This guy. He's a yeah, yeah. He's he's available in there right now. 
Radiation hazard in an exterminate mission. Uh oh. <laughs> an interception against Corpus in Europa. Okay, what are we looking for? Demigorgon, pretty much. Uh. Okay, let's see. So, what are we going for? I'm ki I'm ki I'm I'm tempted to go with a this. Actually, what are you going for? I think it's uh we would want to go with something like that. Oh wait a minute, Barrow is the thing for. Oh wait, no, he's not a thing anymore. Actually, he he disappears that Sunday morning. Okay, never mind. Let's go with Wisp. And we'll probably make a few of these. I'll make like two. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Wisp. Well, I'll make it. I'll make three then. I I don't know why I figured Wisp, but Wisp showed or like it popped up in my head. So, yeah. Also, let me let me check my build for a bit. So I'm not sure if Sunkiss uh, has the thing I'm looking for. Oops. Oh! Hey. Yeah, it does. Hi, Uncle Team. Welcome to the stream. Yeah. Okay, let me, let me check the build. I'm not sure if it's ready. Corrosive and heat. Let's see. Okay, yeah, I think this is fine. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, I'm ready. I'm ready. The system continues to fall into chaos. Check navigation for active uh. invasions. Yeah, basically, um... Uh, so, uh, because of RNG or random number generation, uh, uh, basically, sometimes you don't get what you're looking for. Oh, oh, hold on, let me check something. Oh, it's blank. Mm hmm. Yeah, but basically sometimes you don't get it on the first try. I hope it didn't. I hope it didn't glitch out. I actually glitched it out before doing exactly that. Yeah, Twitch drop. Uh, Twitch drops. I don't think so. Uh, okay. I don't want to break that. Oops. Do you have a matching relic? Okay, which? Oh yeah, I have flare on this. Okay, that's good to know. Funky little status build. Oops, let me go back over there. We need that. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. that's uh. I'm also connected to the Twitch, so. There's gonna be some people on Twitch Don't channel, so I'm gonna be saying some stuff sometimes. I think I should try uh, a what you call uh let's see tower lost. Where'd it go? Uh, so this one is probably not the best one to put it, but I need I need to put some specters. Tower online. There. Right here. Here we go. This is a good spot for Spectres. They've also already equipped that cane drive between runs. Uh, I don't know. Uh, oh, you mean you mean your buddy, her Maradona. Maradona is like her her survivability and some of her utility. Uh, so it's probably not the best idea to hop off of it uh, with this build specifically, but I do I am working on a not in on a melee build But I need the augment to come out first 
Because the augment will finish it. Damn, there's a lot of motherfuckers over here. There we go. Oh, there's a there's some at A. Go. You're already in Titania, make me jealous, yeah. Oh, butchy cat, nice. I think it's I think it's on public and nobody's going to hear. Hear that or or Actually I'm not sure. I think, yeah, I think legitimately it's like you open that. the relic. Yeah. Finish your mission and we'll take a look inside. I wonder if this is I wonder if I should have used the crit one specifically. Oh. Oh wow, they're taking a bunch of them. But you cure it. We have lost control of a tower. Okay. Tower captured. Beginning stream. I'm still trying to find a good time to put my specter. There are a lot of enemies, yeah. Where is the? But there should be um we are in total a place control. that has like two of them right next to each other. There usually is. I think right there is probably the closest I'm gonna get. But she can't do it. How, how come interception? Uh, because interception is usually like uh, the endless one that is like. The easiest one to do in a good group. I think we just wanted to use an endless one. Plus, I think the other one was not ready. You see enemies, I see damage dealt, yeah. I think this build is doing okay. I'm not gonna lie. But I, I, I do I do like interception and uh, not very many people do but I do like it. Oh here we go, here's Angst. Let's see how this kick gun does against her. Or I could just bubble her and have you guys see what you can do against her. Oh yeah, no 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 bubbles needed. Meow. Meow. Oh, yeah, and uh we're where is the thing? Oh. Yeah, where is the other thing here? I see that one. Is there another? Yeah, there it is. I found it. Oh, yeah. So this one is the one with the straight path. Okay, this one's the one with the straight path. Okay. Where is Fidget? Yeah, both flowers on your sentinel. Nice. Alright, you are gonna be a good girl and stay here. And I'm gonna give you a friend. There we go. Uh, did I do it right? Yeah, I got it right. Okay. Yeah, okay, she has her friend. ASMR boss, yeah. Okay, let's see. Oh man, there's one right here. <laughs> Damn. This is the one that is like the closest together. Is she the already supposed the the already specter is supposed to be like somewhere like this, but I think she's fine over there. She should be anyway. There's also a trick you can do of giving her the psychron. Oh shit, Baza. Don't moan like that again, huh? <laughs> Yeah. There we go. Let's Try go again. Signal. Be careful, though. The enemy has surely rallied stronger reinforcements. Okay, Wisp Prime chassis. Come on, Wisp Prime chassis. We got a rare, but we didn't get the rare. Okay. 
Did you get your chain reactant? No? Okay. Mm. The reactant, yeah. Oh! You have captured a yeah, tower. it's like... No, uh, right? Ah. Okay, how are you doing? You're doing good. So how many runs are you going to continue? I have three Wisp Prime chassis stuff. And we're farming Wisp Prime, apparently. So once we run out of Wisp Prime relics, or if we get the Wisp, the Wisp. So we should be good if we get the Wisp, we're not sure. Then again, it might be a situation where we farm multiple Wisps, which would be awesome. I was actually, I was actually thinking about this thing last night because you already prime is getting close enough to even like talk about it. So I was thinking like, uh, like as soon as Wish Prime comes out, of uh, doing like a bunch of Y one, uh, essentially just a bunch of Red Yoretti relics, and my brain went. You know how it sometimes goes dark with some of my random thoughts. It was thinking about uh, uh, about me getting nothing but a bunch of your ready relics done for a while, and just me having like I think it got up to like sixteen or twenty uh, your readies, and me just holding on to them greedily. And I'm like, I don't think I should do that. I should probably farm a bunch of them, but I'm gonna use them as like gifts for people that I like, you know? Or gifts for people who also like your ready and who also would be considered like good, uh, good um, members of the Discord, you know? Uh, probably not in a competition because I don't think you guys, I wanted to have you guys like work for it. But if I can confirm that you're gonna keep it and stuff, I would have like a bunch of your readies to give to a few friends, a few people. Uh, oh shit! Unlimited ammo? Yay! Of course I want some unlimited ammo. Oh yeah, we should probably grab that. There we go. Keep it up. There we go. Super, super high fire rate. I, I, I think honestly, beam weapons might be my favorite weapons in Warframe. Oh, it's this guy. I want to take out this guy though. He, he looked at me funny. The enemy have taken a tower. Uh. <laughs> he looked at me funny. He needed to die. Um. Let's see. Message decoded. Leave none alive. Clear out. Leave none alive. Forces. No. There we go. I think this beam is doing okay. Oops. For some reason, I kind of want the beam to be thicker. That makes no sense. I know the beam usually is like, uh... I don't know, it's like the particles of the beam don't make it look really thin. It kind of like, you know, it's just literally just a beam. Leave none alive. Ah, oh, shit. Ugh. Gotta get that nun. They are broadcasting another message. Make sure the enemy yeah. never receives it. Actually, uh, some people are like, they kind of like wish that they met a like lewd nun. I actually met one before. 
But she was kind of like... She was like super chill. Um, well, she, I, I think she, I'm not sure if she's a nun or if she was just like someone who worked at the church because we don't have nuns here. We do have people who work at churches though. They're a little bit different. But she was like, she was like into new things. She wasn't like into the freaky shit, but you could tell that she kind of sort of knew a lot about like sexual things. But, um, she was a good person. Um, she was kind of old, though. A little old, no old for me. Is there anybody even on there? I think somebody already nuked it. But I'm, I'm, hit, I'm hitting turrets. Oh, never mind, there's people. Yeah, we have every, everyone, everything here is India, yeah. Da, 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 da. Oh, let's see. Yeah, I, 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 I think like, if there's any place that tended to, tends to be like, a huge melting pot of people, we have lost control it's probably of there, because... I'm not exactly sure why, but I know like, a lot of people like to go there sometimes for different reasons and if that's the case there tends to there, there end up being like a huge melting pot and stuff or i know like there's also other places that's like a cultural sponge where they just gotta absorb other cultures to attract more people and tourism or something like that that's also another thing that happens because those are the two things that tend to be really good for tourists Cultural sponges and melting pots. I live in a melting pot. So like a lot of cultures come here. But I've actually heard of sponges, uh, cultural sponges, where they just absorb all the culture around them to be more like, to, uh, to, to be more active in, the, in like other people's communities. I told you about Anne's Mar and I saw it coming and that's why I love whispers in the wall now. Yeah. I thought you let in a little sponge. No 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 no. Cultural cultural sponges are literally just a place that like absorbs the culture of other places. I think Amer America kinda of started as a mixture between a... actually it depends on the state, but depending on the state and also depending on the city, you can either come across a cultural sponge or a cultural melting pot in America. That's why like, you can't really like pinpoint uh, things, right? And I know that like, as someone who lives in a in a melting pot, I know that's the same way everywhere else too. Um, like. Uh, what's a good example? There actually was like a rumor going around that Japanese people are really lewd, but in actuality, they really went to a place that just had is known for their hookers. But like, it's a very diverse place, you know. And they also took all of the uh, they they cherry picked all of the shit, right? They'll be out there for like several day, like several hours, asking questions, and only come across like five hoes, you know. It's kind of like how it works. You look good today, I like it, yeah. I think, uh, this one was is a newer outfit, so you can tell it's like way more thought put together. Uh, but like, I'm, I'm proud of this one. I was considering making it my main outfit, honestly. But then I remember, like, I don't just stream on Sunday, and this is my Sunday... Sunday... Uh, nightgown. So, I didn't think I wanted to wear a Sunday nightgown every day. But, um, my main outfit is technically a bikini. But I turned that into the Saturday outfit. Because I ended up getting, like, a brand new outfit that I like even more. Yeah. Uh, I, I'm using Gazoo Tuber. But I think I also 
uh, had to adjust the intensity of the yelling thing or the the, the uh, sensitivity of the microphone because it was a little bit too sensitive so I was bouncing up and down more than just when I'm yelling and I did some uh, some tests to figure out how to fix that and I figured it out my microphone is way less sensitive now so I'm just not not like blah, all over the place Hey, Malice. Malice, what are you doing inside that place? Oh, it's... Son of a bitch. Alright. Get him through the wall so he doesn't ever, ever look at anybody. He didn't see anybody. I see. Yeah. Mm. Oh, man! Oh. I'll get this. It's his house, man. He just walked in and killed him. Said, yeah. <laughs> his little house. I have detected uh, another message incoming. Do we have any more W1s? I don't have another W. I have, like, unranked W1s, but I'm gonna not use those. Because I don't have any enough, um, traces. Ugh. Ugh. I do adjust. Oh, there we go. Oh, we've we've all been using W ones. Ah, and we're still not getting it. Come on, streamer, look. <laughs> you have captured a radio tower. This tower is ours now. Uh, there we go. Actually, um, I was actually, uh, researching the algorithm a little bit, and I found out something really interesting that I wasn't expecting to hear. Um, the algorithm is tied to your, to your, what's it called? It's actually tied to your, um, IP address. So, you see a lot of people being on like, oh, check this out, I only did one video, and I hit the algorithm. We have control of all four they, they not only did like tricks they learned on their own over a couple of years, but they got a slight boost because the algorithm is tied to their IP address. Uh, it's not like completely tied to the uh, IP address as in like, uh... It, if you if you get rid of your made modem, it'll fuck it up. But it is somewhat tied to it. So like, yeah. Also, another cool thing, it, uh, another thing that I found out is when they would hit the algorithm with their video of like, hey, check this out, you can do it in one video. Usually, they're doing a trick or they already have a recognizable voice, so a lot of people already know who that is. So it's like, it's not, it's not that you make it in one video, it's that you restart it, and you literally had a recognizable everything, right? Yeah. And then the last part of that is, the last video I saw that was the get famous in one video, was somebody who literally had a friend advertise on a bigger streamer's thing. And I'm like, dude, you know not everybody can do that, right? <laughs> like, you, you know not everybody can can make a, a get their friend to get the attention of a streamer? That's not entirely possible. And the one thing I learned is that experience is hard to get when you don't know how to actually grow from it. And you can't just like cookie cut somebody else's experience onto your shit. So it's like, what? But the reason why that popped up is that I'm doing really well right now. But it took me about a total of... I think it's been like five years. But the reason why is like I, I restarted about a year ago. So I'm actually like 
only technically been using this channel for like one year. But it's only now doing well, which I really do appreciate. I just wish my videos were a little bit easier to get myself up and actually do. That's like the thing I'm running into as a problem. Because, believe it or not, YouTube videos are way harder than than Twitch videos. Uh, twi uh, YouTube videos are way harder than streams because all they have to do is be appropriate and entertaining. But if you do a YouTube video, you have to be all sorts of different kinds of shit. Like an editor, for one. I can edit really well, but I have to be a story writer and an actor, too. More data is being That's just hard. Are you willing to risk People using mods to increase fire rate, Gina, in the corner, clicking <laughs> mouse speed as fuck, yeah. 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 I think, uh, um... Vex armor is actually insane. Wow, yeah. Vex armor is good. Um, let me see. Let's go. Let's go with dual carries. I kind of want to get a dual carries prime. Or well, I, actually, I might have one already. Be careful, though. The enemy has surely rallied stronger reinforcements. I think the one thing about like gaming isn't it getting argument in the, in the future. I think it's getting an augment. Yes. I'm not exactly sure what the augment is though. Uh, it's getting an augment this Wednesday actually, because this Wednesday is the 27th, and it's coming out on the 27th. So is your ready thing. I actually have a video planned, and I have the music too, but because nobody voted on the music like they did last time, yeah. Yeah, I, I think uh, I think it might be VR. You have captured a radio tower. Uh, virtual reality? I don't know. Oh, yeah, yeah. You're better off using combat discipline? Yeah. I think, yeah, co combat discipline is probably a little bit better because it's a aura mod. And because it's an aura mod, that means that it can be utilized uh, without having to sacrifice anything in a build. Because aura mods are kind of sort of like not too... Keep not too like important right and a lot of people will swear by aura mods but a lot of the time it doesn't it doesn't actually pull off as as big of a difference as you would think plus with with Kroba he does want to damage himself in some way if I remember correctly and yeah I think that's like the best way to do it I think uh Satoshi was making a video on him and he, he was saying like he, was, he runs into problems in higher levels and like I think my thing is like you don't have you don't necessarily have to go to higher levels and combat discipline actually does well. Logging reality and virtual reality yeah. I think augmented reality is where it affects it's like Wearing a pair of glasses that put a computer screen that looks like it's in the like in there, and then virtual reality is like you're wearing goggles that put you in a new world. You know, I think like that's the difference. I think I prefer augmented reality because um, it kind of would be really interesting to be able to watch YouTube with a pair of glasses. And I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I think it would also be better on my, on my brain. I tried Skyrim VR, it was not exactly fun. I, I, I get the appeal of Skyrim VR, but, uh, if you're like me, and you walk looking down, uh, Skyrim VR is not exactly, like, great, you know? VR in general, actually, because I can't bring myself to look up. And the reason why is if I'm looking at too much things at a time, and it's too bright, I can hurt my head. I've actually, I've actually gotten a massive headache by looking straight while walking. It's mostly because I'm not wearing my glasses. Uh, because I don't know where my glasses are. I've, they've been missing for like three years. But, um... 
I don't look forward because I can't see very well forward, you know? And if I see too much, like, stuff that's all blurry and stuff, I'll get nauseous and get a headache. That's why I don't look outside of a car when I'm riding in a car. I'm usually either looking at something else or napping. Are you... Good thing, Mr. Imagine that there was a Blitz Eximus uh, uh, that was also like an Oxium drone, so you literally could just kill it by letting it run into you. That'd be hilarious. Or actually, you know what would really suck is if it was if it didn't die when it ran into you. Instead, it just did bonus damage on the same element it was. That would actually suck. I would not like that. Damn it! Uh, let's see. I'll get you Forma. Forma sounds better. Mm. They are broadcasting another message. Make Kay. sure the enemy never receives it. Oh, I just got a random K6. I might as well just use it. Holy Friday Festival of Colors. Oh, nice. Oh, it's a holiday Friday and it's a festival of colors. Okay. Mm. That sounds good. Tower captured. Beginning Exit code now. I hate bro. He thought he could sneak away. I haven't tried... I haven't done any holiday stuff in a while. I think the last time we did uh, holiday stuff was Easter. But that was Easter of last year. No, the year, the year before last year. So I haven't done like holiday stuff in a while. The last holiday that oh wait no no wait I remember now we did Christmas, but we uh, we did Christmas but uh, Christmas is like a given right? But when we did Christmas we kind of sort of just sat there get, gave out gifts, ate some food and left. We didn't even have like any party food. We actually kind of sort of just had like. Food, food, food. Yeah. It's Holly today. You not ho oh not holiday? Ah oh, okay. Yeah. Holly. Holly is the name. Oh okay. Holly. Oh, that makes sense. I get it now. I bubbled him. He's dead. Man got bubbled. I was considering making a direct damage build with this. You hit too many on the Acolyte? Nice. Bubbles go burr. I'm not sure. I, I know they're uh, resistant to abilities, but I don't know exactly how much they're resistant to uh, Yoretti's one. Um, so I'm not sure if I quadrupled your damage or if I just um, doubled or tripled. But I know, I know it does do something like that. Inside. Actually, I'm trying to, I'm trying to do the math in my head. But I, what I think is happening is they have it only at the base because I remember every single time I hit them with it, it's like double instead of like instead of like quadruple or something, right? So I'm assuming 
that I doubled it instead of quadrupled it. Because every single time I hit them with it, I should be one-shotting them, but I think I only double it. Their resistance is probably the fact that it only doubles. That's probably what it is. But against these enemies, it quadruples. Oh my god. Meow meow. Nice. Oh yes. For some reason that reminded me. Uh, somebody... Somebody was requesting... Uh... Lots. Extraction is available. So because to be decoded, oh. will you stay or go? Was that my cat? Is that what you guys are talking about? I just heard I don't think I just heard a cat. Oh shit. Nice. I have detected another message incoming. Capture and decode the signal. Okay. What's this? You're dead? Okay. Oh. Meow. I almost went there alone. They fought well. Good dance, all. Yay! Kick unmaxed. That's funny, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's far and west. I think it was Delta. Hold on, I gotta. I'll be right back. Um, I gotta do. I gotta do the thing. Yeah. Uh, because apparently. Uh, apparently it uh. Gave me, enough for, to max it. Fortuna. Uh, yeah. Oh my god. Hold on. I need a... Uh, let's see. Hello, Zude. Good man. Always has been. Maxing. A uh... Than that little duck. Swanning off. Breaking his So it, it made it um should find himself a wife, don't you? The think? affinity got anyway, the rank the affinity open. ranking to the max. That's what I mean. Other services, guild. Ah fuck! I need shelter bonds. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Kill what? Love took me places, Stardust, and love brought me back. We fell to this place together, he and I. Ew. But I was the only one who stood back. Comedy or tragedy, depending on your wage bracket. Comedy or tragedy, depending on your wage bracket. I think it's kind of funny, and I'm There's poor no as fuck, shame sir. In helping your fellow creatures. Mm. Man really did say, uh, or adventure. The adventure uh, I said brain, I don't want to give you that. So I give you fear right though. To have to make. Medical debt bonds, a hey, for Oxion. Give me that, with a asshole. Help. Good boy, sir. You know where to find me. I do not know where to find you. Oh. Smoke finger is an irritant. He brings us things, pretty things, useless things. Smoke finger knew our sisters. He says we did not have sisters. I do not like the way Chatter falls silent when he visits. Mm. Let's see. I'm gonna give you. Some, sh some shelter bonds for this kit gun. Alright. What are we naming this kit gun today? Mm -hmm. 
saw a sport already. Heads in the stomach. Yeah. Yeah. I think, uh... I think they mention it in other places as well. So it's not too... What you all mean build? Yeah. Oh, I know. What you gonna call up? The meme uh nator the meme nator the meme nator well you best get going take care of that now she's some of my best work wait 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 i could oh what well, i i just got an idea Okay, let's do this. Let's try this. So, pretty enough. What's a name? I want to do. Uh. Rakata Prime. Rakata Prime. <laughs> Rakata Prime. Yes. This is how. Yep. Kuba Gracada. I cross Gracada Prime. Ah, I, I should have said Umbra. Umbra Gracada. <laughs> ah, that would have been awesome. Wait a minute. Uh, yeah, Gracada Prime will do. Gracada Prime. Can't okay, see. Um, let's go with Tim Prime win, yeah, pretty much. Uh, where is my, let's do this, Quicker Lake, yay. Oh, after call Prime, nice. Yeah. Uh, uh. Charge? No, I want seeker. Do I have? Yeah, I have a. I have a primary adapter. Let's go with frostbite. And let's change this to. Corrosive. Yeah. I'm high as fuck. What does WC mean? This is wrong chat. Okay. I got the fucking munchies. Okay, invite me again. I think the group is still available. Okay, let's see. Okay, let's drop this. Switch the minute you're ready. Okay, the hiccups. I kind of want this skin. Like at first I was like ew, but then I was realized that most of the base weapons are ew. So. Okay. <sighs> Tatsu Prime, where'd it go? Sochon Prime, yeah.
boom. 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 Okay. Alright. If you still want to do relics, I think I might be able to. Um, I think I might have to level up some, uh, some relics though. Okay. Here we go. What's that? Do, do, do. All right, I got um, I got my cute. I got my Grook out of Prime. We should be good. Um, I can go through the table. I think it's because I have this here, so I can just pop to the table. Is Butchie, Butchie Cat in chat? Yeah, I think Butchie Cat is. It's a uh, Brig. But I think Brig went to go do something, I think. So we might be on our own for a bit. So is it a cat named Butch or a Butch named Cat? <laughs> Want to do Uranus defense? That sounds good. Well, let me let me switch to let me switch to a uh, uh, primary user. Don't they have a forma being made? Guess why I had a forma being made. Oh, it's almost done. <laughs> uh, Zorus. Zorus is currently OP. Well, Zorus is able to nuke with, uh, in, uh, that one mod. Yeah. The Zorus is has become like the the OP glaive now because it guarantees electric procs. Which is really good for influence. Yeah, there we go. I keep forgetting that it's called influence. Zorus it is nice. Okay. Let's go. I think it was defense. What was it? Defense on Uranus? Yeah, there we go. There we go. Yeah. W1. I hope we have a lot of these. I'm also using a Tatsu because I think somebody requested Tatsu gameplay. So I should be able to figure this out. <laughs> yeah, she likes the Slash Prox and Grave Prime. Yeah. Slash Prox and Grave Prime are good. I think the explosion is a slash explosion. The art of combat must be I'm not sure about that though. I don't really have a glaive prime or a glaive, so I'm not sure. Void fishers, See the hands on my ship? You yeah. To open a relic, but are you, you did the thing. Their fury? I haven't done the thing because, uh, I don't know, I find it a little bit too, uh, 
difficult. At least because I, I treat Dark Souls in this game differently, so I don't want to like see. I don't want to like challenge myself Efficient. like that. Defend yourself and use reactive to open relics. Zuzu block. Oh shit! Fury. The enemies are there dropping reactant. The reactant is working on your relic. Find more. They can use this as like a CC. Oh yeah, I, I redid my build. I forgot about that. I redid my build to a. This is funny. Check this out. Uh, uh, like that. There we go. It's it's a breach surge four build. Uh, I I saw I saw somebody do this and I was like I want to try it. So I made a whole ass build for it. And I didn't even need to put a forma. Cuz my build was already halfway there. Ow. Oh wait a minute. Is that I'm not sure if it. Oh no, it does it does piercing, not radiation? Never mind. I was about to say, this could be really hilarious if it had radiation. <laughs> if I can proc them with radiation, they should fight each other instead of me. Okay, let me try this. Oh god, it's got no fire rate. Oh, yeah, wait, I can, I'm supposed to fix that with uh, Prime Shred. Yeah, I think it should be fine. Oh, that's a cat. There's a Korra cat. There we go. There we go. Let's see. Oh! Yeah. There we go. Boing. Uh, oh shit. There we go. There he is. That's it. You open the relic. Oh, uh, looks like I'm gonna have to include some damage on here. Maybe on the first round, probably. Yeah, I think this is uh, what people call the bad map. Which is where parts nice. <laughs> oh shit. Explosion. Oh, what is that? Why? Why is that a hundred seconds? <laughs> That's weird. Is that bugged, or is that, or is that something I don't think it is? Also, a quick question about the bug. No bug rule on Discord. It may do some some traumatic happening. I'm just curious. Oh, so um, so I'm a, I'm like afraid of I'm afraid of centipedes. Um. And I ran, okay, I ran into some, uh, stuff that had, like, some centipedes in it. Uh, and, okay, so I, I'm, like, really afraid of centipedes. That's the thing, it's like, I'm really afraid of centipedes. So, I, uh, so, uh, I ran into a surprise thing on another Discord. No, uh, I think it was YouTube actually. Of uh, centipedes. And I was like, okay, I don't think I want this on my on my stuff. And then I, I was thinking about it, and I was like, there's other people who don't like spiders. 
And other people who don't like scorpions. And other people who don't like roaches or like bugs in general. So, especially since like there's a friend of mine who actually is afraid of all bugs. So I decided that it's probably a good idea to make sure that the people who don't like bugs are comfortable. Because it's actually really easy to freak out somebody who's afraid of bugs. So I figured I'd just not, not have that possible. Parties try to, you know? This thing is not doing as much damage as number bike. I think it's literally just like because I need a I need a way to do damage. Because this one currently doesn't have that. I know it definitely does damage if I were to like ramp up, but it requires getting a kill first. Let's see. Oh, there we go. That works. Oh hey misery! Do you love my company? Or do you? Oh, I'm me. Fucking. Oh! <laughs> there we go. Oh, I didn't get a go. Yeah, there we go. I got Corpus Guy and he gave me a kill. But yeah, I, I have a I have a friend who's on this Discord who is afraid of uh, bugs. And he freaks out if he sees them. And I specifically don't like centipedes, but other bugs are fine. And there's some people who like don't like spiders. So that's basically it. It's just like a to make sure people are comfortable about it. Because uh, I ran it, I, I legitimately I just ran into a random bug online, not expecting it. And it actually made me drop my phone. <laughs> I dropped I dropped my phone and waited for the video to stop before I picked up my phone again. That's actually how much I don't like don't like centipedes. It's kinda like a weird little story about why I don't like centipedes though. I thought that was somebody else's dog. Why is that dog red? Zach when you have wisp parts ready? Uh oh you have his wisp parts ready. Okay, that, that sounds good. Oh, did you buy it? I don't know. Let me see. But the thing is, I don't necessarily think that one is a bannable offense. But they, I think like banning... I'm not sure if it's like, if I said it was or not. But I decided against making the bannable offense. I just like, would like it to be deleted. Rather than have it a bannable offense. Because I know that like, some people like to share, share uh, pictures of stuff. And you don't want to like ban somebody for putting a picture that is literally just like, hey, check out this cool bug, you know? Because as as I got uh, as a person with a penis, I can say straight up, bugs can be really cool. So you might just want to like show a bug randomly. Like, hey, check out this cool bug. <laughs> like, ah, oh, that is a cool bug, you know? It's like that Extraction guy thing, is essentially. Ready. Unless you can handle more of the enemy. I see, yeah. Uh, Actually, oh shit! <laughs> What? Chassis! Uh, we sh yeah, that's cool. That's actually pretty cool. Got two Rift chassis. And we- Oh, uh, let's go. That's cool. I appreciate. As you conquer the foe, so you conquer yourself. I was not expecting that. Arbiters of Sexist. Nice. Let's see. Is, is, is it tier block? Never lose hope, yeah. 
But you can't be all like, I got a thing. All of a sudden, we get the thing. <laughs> so we all have a thing now. But you can't invite it. Nice. Let's go. Dojo. Da -da 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 -da. Oops. Yeah. Ugh. The game is like, oh, you want wisps, huh? Let's give us give you both wisps, and it's like, yay, you got two. I swear this game, this game is evil. I swear, I swear, games in general can hear you, and they do shit. You have a plan, yeah. Booty butter. Mm. I wonder. I should go and see if I could find Gazeltuber on itch.io again, and see if I could see find uh, an update. Because I'm pretty sure that person updates their shit. Because I thought they didn't update their stuff. And then I went and checked on it to show somebody, and turns out that that the person who made Gazotuber did update their shit. And so, yeah. They also came with a couple features, too. I think... Can't say I um, stay in the dojo? Yeah. <laughs> Too much for your switch. Oh, okay. There's too much happening. Also, I don't know how I got out, but I got out. Um, I'm lost. Meow, meow. Uh, oh, here we go. I found it. You invite me. Here. You do job. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's butchy. And uh, she's butchy. That's butchy. I think, uh, um... Yeah, I also have a really basic dojo. Explains. And where... Which... Oh, I have to go to recent. Okay, here we go. Delta 999. There we go. We're going to steal path dojo, which I don't think is a thing, but okay. Steal path dojo. Ah, shit. Delta disappeared. No. You can't stay. On oh, you can't stay on any dojo. Okay. Hmm. That's interesting. Hmm, let's try... Hmm. Yeah. Oh, you, you, you thought it was gonna be the same dojo? No. You thought, yeah, yeah, you thought it was the same dojo. So let's go invite. And invite. Yeah, it's a different dojo. My dojo is simple just because of that. Yeah. Just because of that, my dojo is different. Dijinka Madhouse. Mm -hmm. Actually, let's see if everybody goes in. Is everybody in? No. Oh. Let's see. Switch moment? Yeah, pretty much. Switch does that sometimes. If I remember correctly, 
There's also this thing of like me having to wait a little bit for you guys. Ah, oh, here we go. I think uh, I think Butchy Cat has disappeared again. Yeah, this happens sometimes. Oh, there we go. Butchy Cat's here. They loaded in. It happened. You should be able to see him now. Nyom. 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 Silence! Let me see. It says you don't have cross save on the road. What? Oh yeah, I forgot about that. You have to have cross save enabled to, to trade with somebody with cross save. I think you would have to do that. I think the thing is you'd, you'd have to like, you'd have to go do that. And then you would have to go like, no, you, you don't have, you don't have to, uh, didn't take much time, yeah. That's also another thing. My brain exploded when I was trying to explain something, but I forgot what it was. Also, Fishinachi and Bird and the other thing, too. Bird Goat Fish. Goat Bird Fish. I think, uh, yeah, you would have to sign up your whatever account is your, like, your main account, I think. But also, I think, um, if you only have one account, you just activate it and you don't have to do anything else. I don't think. You just have to go to, like, the main website on a phone or a, or a laptop or an iPad. I think an iPad is also a good one. But you, I'm not sure if you could do that on an, on a watch though. Cause I know there's smart watches. Oh, okay. Oh my God, he has tiny feet. Wait, does he have tiny feet or is he just that wide? I don't know. His ankles are tiny, that's for sure. Is this- is this- it did- Does he skip calf day or something? Wait! Yeah, I think that's what it is. Weird, yeah. This man has weird feet. Some concrete looking motherfucker. Some conk. Gonna have boob on level boots. I don't know. I think I'm fine with him having small, small feet. It's just that I didn't notice his feet ever, because I'm not interested in feet. Well, I, I'm not. I may not be interested in feet, but I would like them to have feet. If that makes any sense. And that's why I don't like Wiss as much. She got no feet. Oh yeah, you can switch to switch, and then you can trade for like that. Yeah. I forget if we have the uh, thing. Switch. Yum. 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 Oops. Cross save enabled. I think that works. I'm not sure. I like how it sounds like scraping even though he's in the air. It's like he has a booster that sounds like scraping. 
near that, but that's how double jumps work. It's temporary floor made with energy. Void, void magic. That's all it is. Void magic. Don't worry about it. Vuban with his big ass feet. Vuban better be cracking with that fucking big ass feet. Actually, does he have big ass feet? Hold on. Oh my god, he has massive feet. What the fuck? Interesting. Hold on, that, that, what's, does he have a skin that just makes them bigger? Imagine if he had a skin that made them bigger. That'd be hilarious. Okay, no, he doesn't have a skin that makes them bigger, but he does have, made, he does have one that makes them taller. <laughs> Oh my god. Vuban. Okay, let's see. I think I sent it, but I'm not sure. There we go. I want to switch to... Mm. I, I kind of want to make him also rock pink. Hold on, how, how do I make him rock pink? I want to... Let's do this, and then let's do the middle. And then... Gamma. There we go. Classic Gamma. Still says everything that says the same thing. Uh oh, that's not good. Green boy. Yeah, it's still saying the same thing, apparently. Let's see. Thank you, nonetheless. Wait, doesn't he have... Doesn't he have a Sandanya? Wait. He does have a Sandanya. Oh, it's big and ugly like him. That's awesome. Good appetite, nice. You wanna do red eggs? Yeah, that sounds good. I gotta do more red eggs. Yeah, let's let's go back to uh, the orbiter first, though. I just pressed the wrong button, I think. That way, we don't force somebody into our dojo. Because I noticed that happens. <laughs> Kublik. You're back next. Okay. Uh oh. 
I got the munchies now. I got the munchies. Really hard. He gets the munchies hard. Reminds me of, uh... That... Uh... What's it called? Gushing over magical girls clips. Because the gushing over magical girls clips are all like... They're always like... She does something and then her body and then hard. And it's like, what? And then you look at the clip and it's literally just like, oh my god, is this the anime? <laughs> Dude. Gushing over magical girls is weird. I actually do want to watch it though, but I don't have I don't I can't find a good place to watch it. I have a Crunchyroll account, but I don't trust Crunchyroll to give me what I want. I wanna watch the sub. I wanna watch the sub because I'm a sub. Me. Um Forma. There we go. Maybe I shouldn't be using this to get Forma. Because it's the... It's a good weapon. Well, I already have one, so that's probably fine. <sighs> this embryonic fluid injector has been recalibrated to wreak havoc on Tile Regor's cloning operation. Defend the injector for as long as possible to ensure maximum damage. Watch out. I'm detecting void fissures nearby. Do you have a matching relic? Oh my god. Relics. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Reinforcements no. are inbound. Hold Where the line. is I'm looking for treasure. This one does not have the much treasure places on it, does it? It actually doesn't. It's cray cray. Fine. There we go. Plastids. Ah. Oops, I missed. I missed. Oh, zombie boy. Dude, zombie boy. He's a boy who's a zombie. Which makes perfect sense. You found a fisher. Look out for reacting. Oh yeah, isn't there like a character in in uh One Punch Man called Zombie Man? That's what he reminds me of. What the fuck? I do no damage. Use that reaction to open a relic. Keep fighting. Look for more reactant. There we go. Now I'm doing damage. The power of Warframe just randomly doing damage out of nowhere. Woo! I maybe I need to aim for smaller targets in the beginning. Aww. It goes immediately. Meh. Get more cold rocks. Cold rocks. So I can get more damage. Uh, 
There we go. Just randomly explode. Oh. Did he just fall to the floor? I think he just fell to the floor. And then that actually happened. Here's spark of these. Oh, a citrine. Okay, never mind. Citrine got the spark of these, yo. Oh, yeah, I had a head. Dude, I actually was uh, looking at like this thing called like, content farms, and apparently there's just people who like to just um, do weird shit about really popular things just to get like uh, views, and I'm like, some of this stuff is weird. It's like, hey, I want to. Uh, what was it? Like it was kind of like the uh, the Elsa and Spider Man shit, but like with Omni and Jax. And I'm like, yeah, kind of act consequences of your actions is very much correct. I was watching that one thing. There we go. I was actually considering like doing content farming, but I realized that like it's actually you have to be on it for a while. And I'm like, nah, I don't want to do that. You have to actually be like bust out content in like a split second. As soon as it gets popular, you need to start pumping out content for it. I'm like, nah. There's like animators and shit. Those are the good ones. Oh, man's down. Wouldn't that be like, I think clips would count. So that would require actually being able to watch something. I don't have a, I don't have an account for that. Aha, oh. Torments. The inferior moist waifu. Where's she at? Huh? Weird. She's over here like, check this out, I can be a puddle forever. Weird flex, but okay. Oh yeah, I have a melee weapon. I guarantee smash rocks. Reinforcements available. Do you oh, but I don't like... I don't have heavy attack if it, uh, mod on here. Mm. I have so many Revenant Prime in our optics. Zombie boy, the boy zombie. Keep 
fighting. Another opportunity to extract will appear soon. <laughs> Hesitating on building Revenant Prime, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's like a weird thing of like Revenant Prime is synonymous with with like meta horrors. So it's like a weird thing of like it'd be kinda like I don't know how it's, it's like it really cringe to try and do uh a meta frame when you're not into meta. Kind of sort of how I feel about Revenant in general. It's like I don't want to touch him because I I don't like meta. That's kind of like the only reason. Building just for MR though. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes yeah. Plus, um, there's also like other things that, that are like really more really fun. So it's like one thing at a time, you know. Yeah. Simple solution: subsume Mesmer skin. 100. Yeah. Well, you can't subsume primes, unfortunately. Open the relic. Finish your mission, and we'll take a look inside. I think I think a lot of people believe uh, wish they could subsume primes. So they could like not have to farm the regular one for the sensitivity. There's also a bunch of people who wish they could subsume primes just so they could post that they subsumed it. That one's cringe. I've actually seen that a lot with like uh with some posts. I'm not exactly a fan of assuming Warframes for content. That's it's really not necessary. Oh, like put healing well instead? Oh that makes sense. He also has uh that one that makes things follow you, which is interesting. That one's also another one that a lot of people don't uh, see as meta. I think it's mostly because like, whenever you make everything like not attack you, it's kind of similar to like, basically his survivability is like twofold, where he makes the enemies not attack him, and they also like, that's a really good CC, and he also manages to. Uh, just like not take damage right when he actually does get hit and that's why that's why his shit is really good you could probably go over measure skin and then not use that other ability i think the way i think the way i see it is um you 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 kind of sort of want to uh use a Warframe because of their mechanics rather than like just because you want to use it. So it'd be a little bit like redundant to not just like not use the ability, you know? You can do that with any frame. You know, not exactly sure if that's the word though, that's the thing. But it'd probably be not a great to not use any of what he is. So yeah. But with augment is the one gives prime primary damage boost. Yeah, that's that's actually pretty good. I think it's mostly primaries, and people love primaries. That's also another thing. His one is his one is OP too, and with the augment, it's like even more OP. Just because an enemy not being able to damage you just because it's on your side is way different than uh, just regular CC. You know. Stopping them in the tracks is not as good as making them unable to hit you, you know? Because even after it, it wears off the, the actual stun that comes with it, um, you're still unable to get hit by those guys. And I think it lasts forever. I'm not sure about that though. The 
Is there a place where I can see the increase in crit? I know I increase crit if I hit them. Oh, there we go. I see. I see. It. I see it. What did it just cash it in? Oh, never mind. Never mind. Hey, Cupid. It has duration and limit of seven enthralled. Oh, okay, that makes sense. And in most cases, if you have a really good weapon, enemies don't usually last more than seven seconds, so... Uh... Thank you, I don't... Wait, did I mention this key Cupid yet? Yeah, I think I, I think I mentioned it to everybody, but um, I wasn't able to play da Dragon's Dogma, so now I'm looking for a new game that isn't Dragon's Dogma. And the thing is, is that um, I'm in the same mindset as Moist Critical. Moist Critical was like, um, even even if he were to. Uh, even if you were to get it on console, or if they were to cha uh, cha uh, switch it up, or fix it, fix the problem, the the first impressions were such a bad experience that I don't think I'll be able to uh, bring myself to continue playing the game after what happened. Because apparently. When I was saying that big creators were not getting hit by this, there is a few big creators who are. And Moist Critical is one of them. Of the enemy. Uh, apparently, it's tied to a bunch of different things. And I'm hit with multiple of them, and that's why it's like that for me. It's important. Ah, you're Limbo. Even though I'm not a fan of Limbo, I probably should grab the Prime just because... You know, even though I don't like him... I should at least have him. What's with Dragon's Dogma? It crashed six. It crashed five times in a row when I was trying to uh, play it for you guys, and then what happened is it crashed while I was playing it alone. Um, the thing is, is that it's got performance issues, and for certain PCs, it's worse than normal. There's a bunch of rumors going around as to why it is, but it's also things like that. Oh, it was getting bad reviews because of microtransactions. Yeah, the thing is, is that the way I'll say it is, Monster Hunter also has microtransactions like that. But the thing is, is my Monster Hunter does not have any of those microtransactions being in the game for extremely easy to get. So essentially. Uh, Dragon's Dogma is selling you, like, something you can literally get inside the game for, like, real-life money. While Monster Hunter, none of the stuff they're selling you actually can be gotten in the game. So it's more like a small downloadable content, right? Uh, and I think that's the, what ended up making it even worse. Because people, are, I think, uh, rage, rage gaming videos said that it's a, uh, it's a, uh, as kind of like a weird defense is. It's all stuff you can get inside the game, so it's okay. But I think, I think that actually makes it worse. That's what makes it microtransactions, stuff that you spend for in real life money that actually disappears after you use it. Downloadable content is different. Downloadable content is when you get something and you permanently have it. And you cannot get rid of it. Uh, I think that's like different. Yeah, we're doing fish ears. I think legitimately that 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 is like the difference between downloadable content and and microtransactions actions for me. It was literally something that is paid for every once in a while to get more of it after you use it. I don't think that's as good as I think that's terrible, basically. Just random medics? Yeah, I think I think I'm just going for Forma and I think Chroma is grabbing some oh yeah yeah just just random stuff. Uh, but I don't I think the one thing I was thinking is 
I don't like the fact that it also has no ability to delete your character. Man, let's see, where is... I think I might be host. So let's see if we can... Oh, there, he's not here yet. Your equipment is garbage. Well, we don't have to go to Steel Pass. I think that's the thing. We don't have to go to Steel Pass, but we are going to be doing relics. Oh yeah, that also works as well. I could switch to your rally and carry you guys. I might actually do that. I might actually switch to your rally for a bit. But today is a kit gun day. And Zaws too. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to be using a Zaw. Yeah, it's kit guns and Zaws today. Chroma nuke, yeah. Melee arcane adapter. Oh shit. Uh, maybe, maybe I'll go with the other one. Where's the other one? Don't I have... Don't I have stuff on my Zaw? Oh, stabbing stick. Does stabbing stick have it? Yeah, stabbing stick does. Influence. Check the mission stats. It's absolutely broken. Nice. Uh, let's see. Oh yeah, I tried to use blast, of all things. So let's do electricity. Electricity! Um... Okay, let's see. I want... Uh... Heavy attack... Fury. Oh, that, yeah, I got that one. That here might... Uh, pressure point. Yeah. What's this? A. Invite. Into Tyrannius on Void. Neo Defense. Nice. Humans here. There we go. Yeah, I'm gonna, I, I have a somewhat of a nuking build attached now. Uh, la, 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 la. Let's see. I want Prime Shred. I can't put Prime Shred. No! I'll try a different one. Zylock and Cap uh, and Adapter first. Nice. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Mm. I want Sunfall. I think Sunfall would be hilarious. Okay. Let's go there. Should be easy, yep. Oh, it's a survival. In Meso. Oh, an A5. Nice. I use this A5 and see if we get the thing. This way, we should be good. Unless you want to go steel pass, but that'll be up to you guys. <laughs> Today's one of those laid back days. Played back. Sweet biscuit. Ew. Oh wait, he Void King left. DC? IRL problem, be right back. Okay, okay. Oh yeah, I did a, uh, I did an animation. I was, I was considering doing an animation this week actually, and I have like a yeah he uh, he needs to go do something. But yeah, I, I oh, did I? Okay, 
I don't my know if my build off. is They're trying okay to choke you out. Not. Hold on. I'm sending auxiliary life support. Okay. You found a fissure. Look out for reactant. Oh yeah, I'm, I wanted to do the uh, Raffier for your running. I went to a dagger instead. But that, apparently this thing is really good. The reactant is working on your relic. I mean, it seems to be good right now, but it's mostly because crucial life support. it's a uh, non steel path. Oh shit! I'm still looking for a specific frame fighter, frame fighter data too. I think I don't have it, but I'm not sure about that. Um. Neja. Oh. Wait, don't I already have Neja? Support incoming. I think I was looking for if that if that's the case then I probably could get multiple Uronics. Oh my god! Look at the speed. Now I'm really glad they decided to uh make automatic melee. I would not be able to push enough buttons fast enough for this. I've delivered a life support capsule to the area. Activating it will buy you more time. I think it also does like a certain amount of hits too. Virtual anti. Oh, what's this? What's that? Oh. Come on, get corrupted. Uh oh. My bad, someone had to realize deep frying bread isn't a good idea. <laughs> they fucked around and they found out, that's for Tyler, sure. Prepare for life support. I'm hope hopefully hopefully they're okay because I don't know if that's dangerous or not because I never heard of that happening before. I've delivered another life support capsule. If I remember correctly, the beam hitting the target is affected by galvanized shot. That's the galvanized status. But I don't know if the beams that come out of it are. Because I remember hearing that the kit guns are coded differently. So I'm assuming that is the case. But I don't know. I probably should go see to these guys and find. Yeah, there's there's ten out there somewhere. Oh, I got it. That's it. You opened the relic. Finish your mission, and we'll take a look inside. I think it would be there for you as well. Oh, no mind. Oh no, one minute. Gotta let them get the, the corrupted. Or oh, we gotta stay together one or two. Uh, get corrupted. Get pregnant! Oh. Never mind, we're good. I never... I never managed to figure out why... 
that is a valid thing to yell out in hentai. Yo. That's weird. Um, let's see. I am sleepy today. I think it's mostly because I mun got the munchies. And what I had to eat earlier was just like a plate of meat. Oh, you know what it is? It's like it's like that time I ate nothing but bacon. This will help our cause. I ate too much protein. Extraction is available. We had nothing else. So my body has to compensate. Hmm. Probably need a starch or something. And a potato. Do I have potatoes? I don't know if I have potatoes. <laughs> potato potato I need a potato I'm gonna go make one later I know how to make it in the microwave that's why I think it'd be a good idea. Yeah. What the fuck? Oh, I ran out of ammo. There we go. You know that for the longest time, I did not know that the gays secondary had um had a chaining beam i for the longest time thought it was just a beam without an explosion and after i made my first one i found out that that is not the case the gaze secondary is a beam weapon but specifically it's a chaining beam arrived. weapon which, if you know how to make it, can make it one of the stronger beam weapons, too. The sympathy for, like, direct damage killing. Because you want to go with pure status. I think you're better off with, uh... Uh, the Amprex, not the Amprex, the, uh, the Psychron. Then again, I think the Gaze Secondary has multiple status effects. So you could probably go with a direct damage build for that. What you can probably do is do uh, Flare, specifically. I have two gazes, but I think one of them is definitely better than the other. But the thing is, I don't know exactly which one it is, because every single time I do tests, it's inconsistent. There we go. Oh. If I go over here, will I be able to find a thingy? Oops. Wrong way. Oh yeah, I can. I can find the last one right here. Yeah. Relic has been cracked open. Finish your mission to find out what's inside. That relic is cracked. Nice. I'm actually considering not eating the rest of that meat and just getting like McDonald's or something. Mm. 
Reddick, Reddicks are an interesting situation because like you don't pay attention to this to the time because you're mostly paying attention to a bunch of other things. So it's it's a, it's as if it's like super fun, but most of the time I don't even realize that the thing is happening. It's over so quickly. But whenever I do do Reddicks, it's always like really fast. Like the, at least it's the time is perceived as really fast. I don't know why. Because it's already two hours, and I'm like, how the fuck did that happen? There's no way that this been this been three hours already. <laughs> it doesn't feel like it. Oh, also, I found out something interesting. Well, yeah, yeah, I do enjoy it. Probably, yeah. That's probably what it is. But like, uh, um, uh, what, what I was thinking of uh, uh, right now is, um, actually, my brain exploded. My brain actually exploded with that. I don't exactly know what I was thinking. Look Never mind. Operative just found. They my brain. Do this you. Oh, somebody's leaving. Or Fang Prime handle. Fang Prime ended up being really good when I made it. I don't think it's like the worst melee weapon. Cause like, cause like my Fang Prime at least is really good. I brought it to I brought that fucker to Mott, and it turned out pretty good. Sliding up. I got like ten solar toroids from something. What was this? It said I got a new message, but I don't think I did. Or probably, maybe that was the new message. Hmm. Oh, what's this? Can I join in? Yeah, you can. Da -da -da. And wait. There we go. Let's see. So I'm doing chickens. Where is my vial thorn? There we go. Hey, how's it going? Oh, uh, uh, we're doing well. I'm doing well as well. So like, uh, yeah, we're doing good. Um, today's been one of those lazy days where you're just doing something you enjoy and it's like two hours have already passed, you know? <laughs> Let me see something. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I kind of want to do a viral on this. Let's try that. Yeah. Those days are good. It's literally just simple days. Mm -hmm. 
Wait, I have an idea. Wait, no, I don't have an idea. Never mind. Uh... I think we're good. We're good, we're good. Uh, let's go. A Roken. I'm just logging in on stream VC in your Discord. Okay, let's see. We're about to have our guest star. Uh, co, uh, co what's he called? Co-star. Hello. Hey, how's it going? I'm doing good. It's good. I just got up from a nap. <laughs> yeah, naps are cool. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know why, but Corvex having his cod piece that way reminds me of like like a really, really, really hairy gooch. I know there one for more. Okay. You gotta get the cards from those. You gotta do one million damage. Your weapons. So you gotta do. It's based on how much damage you do. Calls for a song. So there gonna be uh, either one Watch or two, out. depending I'm on how much damage you do. do you have a hey. and I think it's Fine. personal damage, so you yourself have to do a million damage. Yeah. You found a fisher. But for doing a million damage isn't too difficult if you know how to do it. Um, but you do need to like bring like super powerful stuff. Oh my god! They're dropping reactor. Whoa, oh, wait a minute. I think I know what happened. I saw that timer. You guys are kidding each other. <laughs> Someone activated the laser. Alright. Yeah, the uh, and meta influence is really good. On Glaze specifically, you have one, yeah. It was you, oh, you, oh, you blasted yourself. Oh no. <laughs> I gotta uh, go grab four, man. Yeah. I know that re, uh, actively reloading tends to sometimes blast you with that. Uh, strong laser. Oh, okay. I'm gonna need a hundred because my arc wing is shit. Yeah. You got an available slot? Apparently, uh, which spot? For me weapon. joining the mission? Oh yeah, yeah, we do. Oh, never mind. Somebody joined a bit while I was looking. We might be able to get you in here next one. Alright, sounds good. See, the thing I like about kick guns is the factor of, uh, hacks charge. Yeah. Which, in a way, you kind of have infinite ammo. Yeah. Someone got like that armor screwed. Yeah. I, I ended up getting inspiration to make a kit gun as well. But it's gonna need a couple of formats before I can finish it. Yeah, my newest kit gun has sick format into it. Yeah. Granted, the rattle guts ribbon that I have also really helps too. Yeah. You know, 187, 180.7 crit chance, 120% heat. So I'm doing gas as well as radiation. Finish your mission and we'll mm -hmm. take a look inside. Gas is kind of one of those stats that nobody uses, but it's decent if you use it if you use it in combination with radiation. Yeah. I was using the uh, the. I forget what it's called, the... You know the one that fires, uh, seeking gas darts? Oh, uh, yeah. I was using that one. Four and laser. then it turned out to be a really interesting build. Because, uh... I decided to go with a crit build with your rally. And it ended up doing, like, very decent damage. It actually ended up doing like more damage than I ever thought it was gonna do, and it, it, and uh, using the power of Nautilus, it ended up doing like a lot of work. Nice. Plus it was Mott, I think. So 
So it's like a higher level place. I noticed that a lot of people who who do uh, uh, steel essence farming, they kind of sort of moved on to uh, other survivals. Actually, it's more like the the people who usually go to Mott or Annie, they split. So it's like we're a little bit like some of them who go to Mott for challenge and stuff have gone to the place where uh you fight the labs while yeah. annie is still like a bunch of people who do that but some some of them have even split too instead going for the labs as well because some of them believe it or not find the labs easy yeah because a lot of them were using builds that are actually with beam weapons right mm -hmm. so they actually end up going to uh, that place instead. A lot, a lot of the people who who do certain stuff basically just split up. It's really interesting. Oh, I thought that was him. Oh, it's Torment. Oh. Oh. Oh yeah, I forgot. This is like a. This is like a breach surge build. Dude, Bre breach surge Corvex is hilarious. Extraction is ready. Unless you can handle more of the enemy. You're looking and, forward uh, to the new helmet thingy, being able to make uh, Tav forged. Mhm. Mm yeah. Uh, let's see. I'll get the Magnus Prime Receiver. <laughs> I'm over here farming Forma and getting things other than Forma. Yeah. Yeah, I know that feeling. I I hear, I heard something along the lines of like. Some creators saying never buy Forma because you should be doing Continue products to every day. You will be and my thing is like bravery. most people don't necessarily have the mind of I want to mid-max my Forma usage. Yeah. So that's like a weird thing. Should I put a catalyst on Larks for Prime? Uh... If you're going to be using Marcia Prime for your main damager in Arcwing missions, probably. Because Catalysts tend to be like for the thing you're going to be using. And for Arcwing, you're probably going to want to have a main using weapon, right? I think Larkspur is a good good one for that, actually. So either the mouse salon or the the large spur is a good idea, because the large spur is also really good. I mean uh, the uh, mouse salon is also really good. So you want to go with one of those two. There's also another one called the Velocitus, which is one that not a lot of people will talk about. But from what I've seen a viewer tell me, it's actually really good as well. I forget who the viewer was though, I think they haven't been here in a while. But I noticed that like uh, viewers shift every once in a while. And some of them yeah, will- Yeah, you have some that show up and then mm -hmm. some that don't. Yeah. It also depends on time frame too. Some of them are also there for the YouTube videos instead. But they'll show mm -hmm. up to the, the stream to ask a question. I run into that a lot too. I do appreciate that when they want to know more information. It gets me talking about things that's game related. Yeah. I think talking about things that's game related is probably the, what streamers should probably do a lot more. I think uh, I think uh, I tend to also need to follow that rule too, because I wasn't following that rule for the longest time. Where it's like, 
mostly talk about the stream or some uh, some other stuff because they don't want to get too far into remembering how the real world is, you know? Never talk about yeah. taxes on your stream. <laughs> Nobody wants to deal with that shit. Uh... I think that's like the thing about escapism. It's just you don't wanna you don't wanna be in the real world, so you don't wanna bring the real world to your escape, you know? Actually actually uh I, on that note I was actually thinking like what people really don't like about like certain types of gaming. At certain type of games having certain types of uh, stories. I think it's literally the fact that they're making it too real. Because yes, these problems do kind of sort of exist, but they just don't want to hear about it in the game, you know? Yeah. You can I mean, have... It depends on the kind of game, but yeah. in, in some retrospects, there's a period of time where you have to think of realism versus you know, what you want to experience in a video game. I think it's less realism, it's more like bringing a real problem into something like that. I feel like well, it's it not depends. like putting any resources on the type of I can uh, use it in normal missions. Oh yeah, that's true. Uh, hmm. It really depends on the type of game. Yeah. Like, like I think a, a good game that could probably have like something along those lines is probably a game that deals that's set in the real world but it also requires like a certain certain type of gameplay you know if it's like oh i'm gonna run around and do grand the bottle thing probably not a great idea to talk about anything except for maybe gang stuff like, like if you're gonna be doing a racing game i yeah. honestly feel that doing oil changes tire changes and whatnot and that affecting vehicle performance is not completely out of out of touch. Yeah, that I makes feel sense. Like that like, would actually fit. Yeah, that makes sense. Like the the type of game it is. Like, yeah. hey, you want to play a gar game and you want to do oil and stuff? That sounds like a good idea. You want to do gun games and you want to talk about like uh, gun stuff? That's okay. And maybe like uh, a soldier thing. You want to talk about like how the soldiers are like that's like that but if you ever want to bring something that isn't related to that it's probably not as good a fantasy world should not deal with real world problems I think that's like another one that's that's the one that I, I see a lot is that don't bring the real world into my into my fantasy game that's like a huge thing like imagine if a uh, I, I, I think a good example is imagine if there was like, uh, I don't know which one would be appropriate to say though, but it, it just, I guess they put GTA talk about robbing people. Yeah, talk about gang things in 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 there, and maybe like police officer things as well, or like firefighters because I know the firefighters are also involved in there. But basically like. An overdramatization of like city life. Yeah. It's like, oh, like fuck with the cops and they'll beat the shit out of you. Just have that happen in the game, just as a gameplay mechanic. That'd be really good. Mm. Let's see. Reinforcements available. Let's see. Do you choose to leave now or continue fighting? I think. Oh, you know, we actually would be a good one. Maybe Warframe and a nine to five. Don't want to bring a nine to five into Warframe. <laughs> That'd be kind of funny, actually. That would actually be kind of that funny. Would be hilarious. But, yeah. It, it wouldn't make sense, but it would be kind of funny if they managed to make it work somehow. Yeah. I guess, like, technically, the closest thing to a 9 to 5 you would have is working for the corpus or stuff, but, like, it's not, like, a regular 9 to 5, you know? Yeah. Hmm. 
Keep fighting. Another opportunity to extract will appear soon. It's my bad. I, I shot the wrong thing because I it was red. Working out for the guard base is way worse than 9 to 5. Exactly. It's literally you're born into a futuristic version of cap of slavery. Yeah, basically. Probably a 7 to 6, pretty much. I think I think it's literally a 24 hour job because you technically it's technically like a religion as well. So it's like putting together a it's putting together a, a, a job mixed with a religion at the same time. It's kind of like working at a church, but specifically it's very cor cor corporate, like yeah, for profit. Hey, Parvos. If it's for Parvos, I wouldn't mind. I don't know. But Nefanyo, yeah, Nefanyo is probably an ass. That's probably how I see it, too. Is Parvos. Part of the reason why it's, yeah. why it's considered to be the way that it is is because of Nefanyo. Yeah. But, uh, in fact, uh, Par uh, Parvo Scranum apparently wanted to fix the corpus back to what they used to be. Which was more of a selfless uh, and caring kind of thing. Kind of like more of a charity sort of situation. But Neff Anjo turned it into being lazy and stuff. Yeah. There is like, don't be idle and it's literally just like having a bunch of people below you work for you. But like, uh, uh, part with Granum was more like, dude, if you, uh, er earn your money, and when you get excess, use it to better the world. That's what his yeah. thing was. I think I appreciate that more. As you can see, as you can see, I'd be a little corporal. I would be a little corporal. I mean, it is their fault for having a cute fucking waifu in their uh. uh Trading uh, update. <laughs> the cute waifu. Actually, I'm not sure if everybody, like, n most people know about the cute waifu, but there is actually a cute waifu in the Corpus update. Yeah. Corpus kind of do, don't they? And some techno shit. The Corpus do. I think I think the Dynamite it's like uh uh what's a good example? You actually like I I think like legitimately uh a, a good a good a, a good actual real life example is probably like Christian music because it used to be like um they did music in like uh classical styles that were just like that had like uh. Like it was based on like religious stuff, and nowadays it's just like Christian rock, and it's like Christian rock sucks. But well, my, the lady who takes me to exercising listens to Christian rock, uh, not a Christian rock, but uh, Christian music, and I'm over here like, damn. Not only is this something about I don't about, uh, this is about something I don't like, but it's also ass. But you listen to like uh, orchestra stuff that was based on like that sort of way of life. It's actually really good music, I'm not gonna lie. Like the orchestras and stuff. I had like a bassist in there. Uh, and an old fashioned, old fashioned really old choir. Like back when choirs were actually like a thing. That shit was really really good. But nowadays it's just like, mm, I think I'd rather listen to Disturbed. Disturbed uses Bible verses in their music sometimes, and I think I enjoy that more. Yeah. So it's kind of funny. Uh, the singer for Disturbed was was Jewish, but he was kind of ousted by the church. Yeah, that usually is a thing. The choir is still a thing. I think choirs. I think choirs. I'm not Benjamin sure. Benjamin Bull also uses choirs as well. Yeah. 
I, I like, for I like... example, Lost, they use a choir in there. A little piece of heaven, weirdly enough. Yeah. Yeah. I think uh, it, it's still a thing, but the thing is, like, they don't, they don't do it as much anymore because, uh, I don't like, I, I think they'd rather sit there and talk or they do other stuff as well, but fires used to be an old thing of like, it, it's kind of, it kind of went the way of the Pledge of Allegiance to the flag, where it's like, it was just a little bit, the, the people considered it too far. And, I'm, and they kind of sort of made it to where it's like not as great. I think I think legitimately after that started being a thing, I started to not enjoy school as much. I was one of those weird people who actually looked forward to the Pledge of Allegiance because, you know, I, I, weirdly enough, I'm kind of patriotic. And when they took away of that, I was like, eh, I don't like it as much. Especially since they also came with the uh, No Child Left Behind thing, and I really hated that. I didn't like how they the treated one, the kids after that. The one thing that I kind of hate here is you, your great, your actual schoolwork doesn't matter until you get to about grade nine. Yeah. You're pushed up to the next grade whether you pass or fail. Yeah, that's what no child up behind until, basically was. Until grade nine, here you cannot fail. Yeah. Grade ten is where your grades actually really start to matter. Mm -hmm. Guys, we're talking about high school diploma. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then grade 12, well, you actually can fail and not get your high school diploma. Yeah. I got the certificate because I was stupid. But the thing is, is, uh... Uh, they... Reinforcements I, I, available. They held me back. Now or continue fighting. Um, because I was at the very beginning of that. So, yeah. Doing fire crit damage, drunk. Oh, four, four more right there. Oh shit, a Wukong relic. Somebody used a Wukong relic? I gave me I have some. Awesome. Dude, we need to get Wukong Prime blueprint so I can get a hold of Wukong Prime. I just started a defense mission. Yeah. Let's see. Mm. It's like your own Keep personal. Fighting. Another opportunity to extract will appear Let's soon. See. Yeah, vaulted relics, nice. I used to have Lots a bunch of vaulted relics. relics, but actually, I still do have a bunch of vaulted relics actually because a bunch of them got vaulted after a while. But I've been yeah. using relics just to get weird shit like forma and stuff. And if I remember correctly, the reason why I used all my Wukong ones is because um, I ran out of Axie relics, so it was the only Axie relic I had left, and I didn't, I wasn't planning on getting Wukong at that time, so I never. How did you run out of Axie? Uh, How did you run out of a head of a relic in general? Yeah, I literally, I literally ran out of Axie. I have no Axie. Oh jeez. Yeah. I don't know how that's possible. You literally have fuck tons of relics. Yeah, I, I, I go to survival all the time. That is usually a place where you get a lot of relics, but it apparently it just doesn't have Axie. Well, it has some Axie, Weird. I don't know. Or not, yeah. yeah, I'm currently in a defense mission. I can leave after wave 5. Yeah. I think this is the last one for Delta, uh, for uh, Chroma. Uh, Alright. Oh yeah, hold on, let me, let me, I forgot to highlight my OBS, because apparently I have something else that dates to 2018, 100 plus million, yeah. I hear, oh, um, I was actually, I was actually chilling in a uh, trade chat one time. I think I made a video about this actually, but I saw a motherfucker selling a uh, Fullman ribbon for a hundred dollars. I mean, I uh, know a thousand dollars. I think it was, because it was like a fifteen, fifteen thousand uh, or something. 
platinum. Or so I would it was either a hundred or a thousand, but I know it was something like that. But like I did some math and it was after I figured out what the the combination was, right? But essentially yeah. you take the price of platinum you're spending and divide it by fifteen if you're doing the American dollar. And you'll find out how much American dollars you're spending on that one item. And I did that math and found out this motherfucker was selling a Fulman ribbon for about a thousand dollars. And I That's was like, insane. That's, yeah. And it's like, oh, uh, somebody was uh, was on the video and said like, you can get it for uh, <laughs> you can get it for a discount. But my thing about that is. I don't count discounts when I'm when I'm looking into stuff. And the way I know and it, even yeah. then, the most yeah. amount that you can pick up mm -hmm. is a small fraction of that. So you have to get quite a yeah. few discounts and not spend any of it yeah. to acquire that. Yeah. That's what I think, you have to remember. I think one thing I was thinking was um uh, an apple analogy. Essentially if you get if you get an apple and it's fine and it's like I I'll say five dollars, right? Yeah. And then you get another apple and it's five dollars, so it's ten dollars, but you get a third one and you get one for free. Does that remove the value of the apple or do you just get one for free because it's a promotion? Right? It does yeah. not remove the value of the apple. It just makes it to where you get a free one for spending a certain amount as a promotion. That's yeah. how I was thinking about it. Uh, when it comes to that because when it comes down to it yes it is a thousand dollars even though you do get it for, for what you call but um basically you have to look at the reality of the situation not like a dra dramatized or extreme version of it and that was a thousand dollar ribbon just to put like the reality of the situation right there's a lot of people yeah. who don't like whales because nobody likes spending money on a game afterwards. But the way I see it is that it's only bad when you don't when you don't realize that it is not a good investment. When someone, uh, if you know it's a bad in a investment that doesn't mean anything, but you still do it, that usually means like you're aware of it and you have and you're mentally sound enough to make the right decision. But when somebody is like, is like unhealthily spending like thousands of dollars rolling a Cooperol fur pattern, then you know you have a fucking problem. <laughs> Actually, do you remember that? There was this yeah. guy who was rolling a Cooperol fur pattern, so they removed the uh, they removed the gambling of that. Because yep. he spent like a thousand, like a thousand dollars on a fucking Cooper fur pattern. And more, one point five. Yeah. And that, and, and which I think is insanity. Yeah. Because like when you look at how many people spend since I will play fur pattern, yeah. Pretty, yeah, that's what it sounds. It's interesting. Um. I think one of the answers is, uh, um, not, not all whales are people who want to be mo the most powerful by, by spending money. Because the way I see it is whenever I whale, it's because I want something and I grab it, right? I don't want power, I just want to have the cool thing, right? So, yeah. if I, so that's part, basically how I say it's like, it's not necessarily all like, oh, all the whales are gonna stomp you. Although a lot of games that have that problem have it really badly because yeah. it's usually pay to win, which I do not like. If if the difference in money can ca cause a difference in power, I don't like that. The thing that kind of annoys me with a lot of a lot of games these days is the factor of how I, I guess yeah. I guess the big discrepancy between those that have money and those that don't. Yeah. I, and I, think... I kind of like Warframe because it doesn't allow you to purchase everything with a thousand bucks. Yeah. As there is kind of systems built into the game, so therefore mm. 
you can't buy everything right off the get go. Yeah. I, I think a, a good way to say it is it's not that it removes the value of something. Like like some people say. I think it's more like the fact that it you makes have it to actually work for it. Yeah. It, it, it makes it, it it makes it to where like Thanks. every single time you get beaten in the game in like a PvP setting, you always got to question whether or not it was actually fair. I think yeah. that's like the huge thing. I kind of want this. But yeah, I, thought I, really, I think also does a pretty good job with that too. Yeah. They fought well. How is this damage yes. fair? Oh. It's fair because um, you, you, you have to you, actually you, play the game. You actually have to use your knowledge to figure out how to do that much damage. That's how it's fair. Yeah. Because legitimately, I technically could grab those mods, but I still have to utilize those mods properly. Yeah. Plus... Uh, it's mostly trading I would get that from, you know? <laughs> uh, but yeah, that's probably, that's how I see it. But it's definitely not fair to our enemies, because our enemies are like, Oh, I don't do that much damage, me. I do have aptitude, and it was doing that much damage? Like, that little damage? That's crazy. I think I went wrong with this somehow. You have to play Chroma, yeah. Yeah, you gotta play Chroma, and then you gotta know how to use Chroma. Cause that's like the that's the thing. This game rewards knowledge more than more than the skill. Although you're ready is a skill based frame, so she's kind of like a thing of like you have to put in a lot of effort, uh, to figure her out. And Chroma is like a, a frame that requires a lot of knowledge. Uh, without the knowledge, you won't be able to utilize him very e easily. Well, it's kind of the same with pretty much any frame when you think about it. Yeah, it's every frame serious. requires some level of knowledge and understanding. Mhm. Mm I kind of. Okay. Uh, yeah, I think we have enough time for one more mission. So I'll invite Yakados. Oh, I'm in a mission right now. Uh, okay, never mind then. Uh, let's see. Mm hmm. Octavia has entered the chat, pretty much. Go to the left. Okay, let's see. Oh yeah, uh, Octavia is an interesting frame. Because she requires you to, to pay attention, but she doesn't requ require that much knowledge. Yeah. She kind of started, uh, thank you for a good time, good night, yeah, good night. Yeah, let's see. I can leave after three mm -hmm. or after five. Yeah. You want to join us in Kit Gun Day? Sure. Yeah. We got to do some Kit Guns. I think, uh. Yeah, I made a Gricotta Prime. <laughs> if, if I wanted to do a Gricotta Prime, I should have went with Fire Rate. That's probably what would have been great. Good night, Chroma. Good night, Chroma. Three percent critical damage, forty times. Hold on, Mr. Calculator. I'm gonna need your help. Okay. Three times forty equals a hundred and twenty. Wait, a hundred and twenty? Wait a minute. This is a hundred and twenty. Does that mean frostbite is redundant? Hmm. Ah, uh, no, it's misery. That means, yeah, it means frostbite is redundant. Okay, that's unfortunate. Uh, let's see. Aptitude. Hunt munition. No, not hunt munitions. I want vital sense. It's fun at least, yeah. Makes sense. Uh, that fucker, he killed me. Oh, damn. Well, you know, Degoth, she has the free death sort of aspect. Yeah. Mm 
Where is my heat mod? Dermite rounds, there we go. Got dermite rounds. Uh can I put anything else? Circuit is so buggy that Zephyr's tornado goes to the previous map. Oh damn. Yeah. Holy shit. That is unfortunate. <laughs> uh, oh, two minutes. Two minutes for my former. Two minutes. 25 mm. seconds of the yeah. third period. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why I was thinking hockey. Hockey. Because you're Canadian. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> <laughs> I think I think for me, legitimately the sport that I would think of is probably football. Even though I hate football, I would still think about it, you know? Because I'm in a place where football is really popular. In fact, in Hawaii, like, football is really fucking popular. No one's going for a fucking basketball game. That's not where you want to... That's not where you want to go. See, so there was a time that I did care about basketball. Yeah. So I, I, I had a very good reason. You see, yeah. my ex looked really good in a pair of basketball shorts. Yeah. So... That was the entire reason why I went to the, her basketball games. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's an admirable reason, actually. Um, should I use this fucking ribbon? Up to you. I kind of want to. You know, I want to use this ribbon. I guess I'm kind of spoiled because I have kick. I have ribbons for all the kick gun chambers. Yeah. I rolled. I rolled this ribbon a while ago. I don't think I ever, like, finished it. I'm gonna go with Corrosive and Heat. Uh... Somebody, somebody was saying that they would want to go with Heat for... For the thing. For that, uh, for... What's it called? I forget what it's called. Spore Laser? Not the Spore Laser. It's called the ALAC. There we go. The ALAC. And uh, I, I agreed with them, but it was also like the ALAC video was the video that people were tripping out on. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Like, I don't, I never checked, after the, the comments stopped, I never checked up on it. But apparently they were fighting for a while. And there's like I, if you're yeah. if you talk about the best for for the spore laser chamber, mm -hmm. gas is one of the best ones. Yeah. Because of the way that it works, it can actually spread to other enemies. Mm -hmm. Alright, I'll be leaving. This group yeah. sucks. <laughs> Everybody's going down and I'm sitting here like Wow. Yeah, that happens. Yeah, I know. Oh well. I really wanna form up for this damn thing. Cause I wanna put my shred. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and I'll be done in Aru pretty soon. Oh, nice. Yeah. <laughs> Enemy. Alright, Jimmy, an invite. Hey, let me build this for me. I'm gonna shoot you an invite. Ow, that hurt! <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I had right to. <laughs> oh, my cat is here, just chilling, being a cat. Oh, was she meowing? Is that what? Meow. I, I, heard, I, I heard her meow after somebody was saying meow meow, and I was confused about it, and I just realized my cat's in my room. So I think she was meowing to either get in or get out. By the way, speaking of which, make sure you interact with your, uh, Kavad, with your pet. That's one of the night wave things. Oh, okay. Many things have been taken from us, it's true. But fortune favors the bold, and there ain't none so bold as people with nothing to lose. I have something to lose. 
I could get my Yoreli taken away from me. That would fucking suck. Dude. So, you run one around in Neo Defense? Mmm, this sounds good. Oh, shit. No, not that one. Why can't you pay your, pet your Sentinel? I don't know. Yeah, I know. Mm. Oh, yeah, speaking of anything... which... We need... Uh, later, I have to go to the Zeraman. Because I need to get standing for the Zeraman. Oh, let me... What, are you rank Are you fully ranked up with the Zeraman? I don't know. But, oh, yeah, I think I am. But the thing I'm looking for is... Um... Uh, what's it called? Uh, the Verdi, the Verdi skin. Oh, uh, okay. The Verdi is a cute little bird drone. <laughs> it's like, why not use the Orda skin? He's a he's a owl, and it's like, no, he's a cicada. And uh, I don't know. I I don't really like the 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 Ortis one because it kind of sort of I don't know. It's just like. Not cute enough, but that makes any sense. Yeah, that makes sense. Their rage is vehement, their focus impressive. I... Give them all the Holo Cavill. Mm -hmm. Void Fishers, you need the interesting name, the relic, but are you confident you can withstand their fury? Koika boy. Defend yourself and use reactant to open relics. Koika boy. Oh, Koika boy. That's a that's an L. Mm. Use that reactant to open a relic. Don't forget the reactant. You need more to open that relic. Uh, you could can't be used. It's too bad. Oh, really? Says who? Says me, because the meta players do say that they're weak. Oh, really? Tell that to my kick gun, which is uh, free shotting most of these bitches. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> what happens when you figure out stuff. Pretty much. Oh, I also had somebody tell me that the Ochre is really weak. You know, after I nuked, nuked an accolade. And I'm just sitting there like, oh, really? Then how come I was able to take him out so quick? Mm -hmm. The Volcar? I can't wait for the sticky. C yeah, I can't wait for the sticky corners update. Yeah. The one thing that I do have to say I kind of hate about Hell Helldivers is the fact that you actually have to remember to reload. <laughs> it doesn't automatically do it. Oh yeah, and don't you have to like stand still when you're reloading too? No, you can run around. Oh. It's just the fact that you actually have to remember to reload. Your oh, character right. will not automatically do it if your clip's empty. That makes sense. Warframe, if a clip runs out, you'll automatically reload. Mm -hmm. But in Helldivers, if you run out of ammunition, your character will not automatically reload, mm -hmm. even if you have other clips available. Mm -hmm. Instead, they just say, need to reload, need to reload, need to reload. Okay, I get it. Oh yeah, when, I remember you uh, doing that last night, and it, so you said it's R. So yep. did somebody like not know how to reload for the longest time? Yeah, except they were playing on PlayStation. Uh, it's usually it's usually Square. Yeah. I was with the I was with a group of people last night. Uh, they're all playing on PlayStation, but they're pretty good players. Yeah. So I added, I added the two guys to my friends list. Mm -hmm. I don't know, I had a lot of fun with those guys last night. 
Yeah. <laughs> you need to get hell divers. No. I have to wait until my money comes in. I know. Technically speaking, I need to purchase it. I need to stop horror with James's. <laughs> He's like, I want to play it too. Yeah, I know, but we only have one license code on the family account, so we can't play at the same time. It just so happens that he works Monday to Friday, so I can play. Huh. <laughs> You know, it's funny when people say that Dagoth can't armor strip. Yeah, it's like, did you even read the ability, sir? It Actually, says, fun fact, it doesn't say on the ability. I always thought it did. What? It doesn't? Yeah, it doesn't actually say. It oh. just says the four does extra damage when cast with Doom. It doesn't actually say armor stripping. That's weird. Probably, yeah. just probably, uh... But uh, the weird thing is, if you watch the video for the for four, it clearly does show armor stripping. Mm. So while the description doesn't say armor stripping, the video does. That makes sense. Yeah. And if I recall, Pablo had quite a bit of say in Dagoth. Yeah. He knows how important armor stripping is. It's uh, apparently more yeah. important to most players than damage vulnerability. Even though yeah, that actually, weirdly enough, doesn't have very much damage vulnerability. Like her armor is not exactly high, mm -hmm. but she's not a terrible frame. Yeah. So it'd be funny it, to mention. How funny it is, how close I come to death so much, mm -hmm. playing Dagoth on Steel Path. Yeah. And sometimes you'll see me with like three health, and it's like, how are you still alive? I don't know. Mm -hmm. Aren't you kind of scared? Well, I have a free death, so I'm okay with that. As long as I can survive 20 seconds after that, I'm good. As long as there's no nullifiers. Yeah. Nullifiers, the bane of my existence. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I noticed that every single time I use a, a primary, it just does some some ass damage. Every single time I do a secondary, it does great damage. But it's like I'm not changing oh, anything about me. my. Yeah, it's not, I'm not changing anything about my builds, and I and I know how to build properly. So I'm over here like. Maybe, maybe secondaries are actually that good with like direct they damage. Are. They it, are very good. You just have to work on. You just have to work on understanding on how to do damage with them. Yeah, I definitely know how to do it's damage with a secondary, figures. but doing a damage with a primary seems to be a little bit like different for me. Because I get, I guess like. Secondary uh, primaries are built with Hunter Mu Mumu in mind. I know primaries are built with Hunter Munitions in mind. So no, I never use Hunter Munitions. The, the thing is, is that uh, primary weapons just do like ass damage without prime uh, without Hunter Munitions. I like, disagree. Like I, I've never I've never had a primary do really good damage without it. I've had many. Yeah. I don't know, it's probably something up with the build. But I remember like, yeah. Uh, like, yeah. yeah. I remember like, Extraction what would probably be a thing is, uh... You can handle more of the enemy. I, I need to complete this build because it's not complete yet. Mm -hmm. What do I want? Go primary right now. Oh. Mm -hmm. Uh, White King's going. White King has to leave. All right. Yeah. All right. Good GG. 
Uh. What I Unless noticed you for... want something specific, I'm just tossing up relics that I have shit tons of. Oh yeah, I I need four more. That's all it is. Uh, I'm just getting a bunch of Forma just because I figured out a good way to rush it. Um, if I rush it, I save. I already Forma blueprints right now. Yeah. Okay. Holy shit! Doris is worse than I saw often, yeah. The Zor the Zorus definitely needs to have some help when it comes to its damage. Yeah. But I think it's more of a nuker when you actually get the get the mod that makes it do that. Yeah, it's definitely one of those new weapons. Every, every single time I look at gameplay of like of like different people and I see them use a primary I see oddly no low numbers even though they're still killing which is interesting like I mean single shot I'm doing 40,000 yeah with my kick gun which kind of kick gun is it basically done it's a rattle it's a rattle guts uh, I must have done something to this I, I, I yeah, think, what's your what's your grip? It's the tr uh, uh, tremor. Tremor, if I remember, has high, decently high crit chance, but it also has high status. No, not that. That's, 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 that's not the. That's not the. That's not the. That's not the grip. That's the loader. Yeah. The loader is the one that uh, deals with the stats. Yeah. So, what I think is happening is I have the one that does 50 50 rather than, uh, like, oh, okay. uh, yeah, that's probably what it is. I know my other kick gun does way more damage. Yeah, like my Cobra Necromancer has really slow fire rate, so Frost Moccasin, I wanted to make a better fire rate type weapon. Yeah. So, technicalities, the builds for this one versus Cobra Necromancer are very similar, because this one has a much higher fire rate. Mm -hmm. They virtually have the same mod configuration. Yeah, if, if I remember correctly, isn't, um... Isn't isn't rattle guts multiplicative in yeah. uh, damage? Okay, that makes sense. So yeah. that mean, when it does galvanize stats, it's multiplicative. So what I need to do is I need to put a damage mod on this. Cause I don't have a damage mod on it. So what are you shooting at? Oh wait, are you using viral on your weapon? Yep. Oh yeah, that's why you're doing more damage than me. Viral boost. Yeah, that's why you're doing more damage than me. I'm using Toro, so... Oops, my bad. I just clicked that got, thing to look out. I got basically two builds for Frost Moxin. One that does Viral, which is equipped with Dagoth. And then I got one that does, I believe, Radiation and Frost. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they built that one for Frost specifically. Yeah. Yeah, I think I think I, know, I think I figured out what it is. I'm not, I'm not using viral. I'm using corrosive. Corrosive also deals pretty decently too. Yeah. I know viral. Uh, if you build it up properly, it does more. I'm only doing up to like four thousand. So I do need to include a 
uh, base damage mod on this thing. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna get rid of the heat mod and put a damage mod on this. Wait, did I? I don't think I formed this. I meant to form with this, but I think I actually might have forgot. Yeah, Frost, Frost Moxon took me six forma to mm -hmm. get to where it is. Holy shit. Our defense target died. Mm. Fuck. That's fine. Mm -hmm. I wasn't even paying attention to the defense target. Yeah, I forgot, I forgot the defense target was a thing. <laughs> you and me both. Okay. I, I'm going to do things to this build and see if I can fix it. Because currently I'm running into issues with it. Hmm. Okay, get rid of thermite rounds. I yeah, want... this one does gas and uh, radiation. Okay. And cold. Mm hmm. Can I see? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Ah. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna level this thing up. You wanna come with me? Sure. Yeah, sure. Okay. okay. I need to figure this thing out because I'm pretty sure something wrong on my end. I'm making sure not to boost it with anything Warframe related, so... Um, then again, I think my Sentinel is boosting it. I'm using Corrosive. I'm just bringing some stuff to level two. Okay. This is a stress test. Destroy all specimens as quickly as possible. Okay, let's see. In this chaos, I need to figure this thing out. These creatures will be revealed. It's currently not performing the way I wanted it to. Ice Hawk, which is a thing, apparently. If he's not Malt using Frost, then I think he's using the wrong one. I hate about Sanctuary Onslaught is the fact that fucking Samaras disables abilities. Yeah. I'm hitting directly to health and already doing like more damage. I think it's mostly because like I'm using viral against uh, infested, which I think is more damage. I'm not sure about that though. Yeah, it does. I think definitely what would really help is me putting an actual damage ball on this. Yeah, Serration's pretty good with that. Because mm -hmm. I, I think 
cake gun cake guns are all multiplicative. Increases. Many of them are. Not yeah. all of them. Not all rattle of them. guts is multiplicative. Okay. Yeah. I think his rattle guts probably does need to have uh, a damage mod as well. Because I think that's like the thing that um the only one that I'm aware yeah. that isn't multiplicative is uh Tome Finger. Tome Finger, yeah. Yeah. Oh, is there a, yeah, there is. There's a uh, hydroid here. The yeah, enemy really frost. Mm -hmm. Frost the buoy. Ice Hawk is using Nyx. Oh, he's a legendary. Liar. He's a legendary four. I wasn't expecting a legendary four in Hydron uh, in this level today. Twenty yeah, events invested was not great, but we did it. But well, I think uh, one more, and I should be able to level this up. But I only yeah, have enough. Oh, it's another! It's, a, it's another round of invested. What the fuck? Two rounds of infested at once. Did it? Today's leveling is not going to work out very well, is it? I was watching a video and they were saying how leeching is, uh, like, it's fine as long as you actually do something. Yeah. And I do agree. Le there's leeching and then there's, like, leeching in an inappropriate way. Mm -hmm. Where it's just, like, you're having a bunch of people do all the killing for you. But I think you should at least be able to build it properly before you... Or at least, at least build a, a build that works in that level you're going to, you know? Yeah. Well, don't get me wrong. I understand when you first start doing Steel Path, you're not going to be able to keep up with it, as you have to better your builds. Mm -hmm. But it's slowly making progress to become better. Yeah. Like, there was a period of time where I wasn't able to do Steel Path. Mm -hmm. Just like you. Yeah. I remember... Like, now we find Steel Path kind of a breeze, but there was a time where me and you struggled with Steel Path. Yeah, it's always a thing. Yeah. The only time it's never now a thing look at most is... Most of our builds, yeah. we're able to do Steel Path with pretty much any Warframe. Yeah. The only time it's never a thing is if somebody decides to go and literally um, grab a bunch of information from somebody who's done it already, you know? Yeah. If you're a quick learner, then it usually works out, but like usually they get bored of the game pretty quickly. Not all the time, yeah. but it happens a lot. Especially yeah, if um, somebody gets a boost, you know? Yeah. Like you, like someone actually ends up getting a whole bunch of really powerful mods from somebody. Because then you're constantly using those really powerful mods, so you already know how to use them, you know? I need one more level and I can, and I can go. The thing I like about being on PC is you can just press P and mm -hmm. find out of what level your stuff are at. Oh, nice. <clears throat> if I finish these guys off, I should be able to get level 20. Uh, oh! That exit almost got me all the way full. Come on, come on. I'm not sure. Yeah, I got it, I got it. I'm ready. Hey, right. stay back. Yeah. yeah. Ow, bitch. I just got my stuff to lo level 30 as well. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Next week we have an Ember Forma. Oh, nice. Yep. Gift of a Lotus Ember Forma. So I'm kind of excited about that. Mm -hmm. And speaking of which, I think I need to go check out Teshin. I need to wait for it to reset. Mm -hmm. I don't think I checked Teshin this week. 
Oh yeah, today's Sunday. I have like mm -hmm. a bunch of things I gotta do today. I I gotta do the Archon like I usually do. Yeah, it's not quite reset yet though. Yeah, it's almost reset. Not quite there, but it's almost there. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. I believe it's gonna be Nira. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, so what do you want to run? Uh, 80 times 6 is that. So we want... 388.3 times 5.8 equals... Mm. And then times, let's do 5.4. Okay, this will do a lot better damage. It's also got viral. I think, isn't viral like, viral is up to, okay. Up to three and times 4.25. Okay, this will this will do a lot more damage. If if it's multiplicative, like we think it is, so we sh it should be a lot better. Yeah, I know the rattle guts does actually stack up its damage up to five. Yeah. So if you hit concurrently five direct hits, it hits, it hits one, then two, then four, then eight, and then sixteen. Hmm. Let's see. Do I? I don't have another forma, so we can probably just try this now. Let's see. I have one plat. I cannot give you another forma. <laughs> I'm afraid we have just one plat. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna bring. I'm gonna bring Yorani's dagger. And I decided. I decided to give her a dagger. To Chris Prime. Okay. Okay, I think one more relic, but probably not a defense mission this time. Well, we oh. don't have any defense missions. There's no endless. Mm -hmm. There's an interception. Mm. Probably not an interception though. We don't want to do that. Let's see. I hate interceptions. Let's go. Steel essence farming then. All right. Let's Alara. Go. Alara. Mm, yeah, let's try Alara. I see wants to join in. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, I, I I think I think I only have like a couple people watching as well. Yeah, I'm watching. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, did like you start? It... No. No. Oh, okay. Do you still have a question mark on my screen? Yeah. <laughs> Cupid also has one plat now. That one plat, no, that stuff. Hang on, I'm gonna change my playlist. Playlist? That's... I forgot that, um... I forgot that today was Sunday. So today is... Today, okay, in 30 minutes, we're gonna be doing the Acolyte. You mean the, uh... Archon, there we go. Archon. Archon. Because I'm like, Accolade we could do any time. Yeah. We're about to do an Accolade. <laughs> uh, okay, let's ramp this bitch up. Give me energy, thank you. Maybe, uh, wait, do you get orange crits? Do I get orange crits? Yeah. Uh, with my kick gun, I do not 
not without Dagoth. Oh, okay. But I still get pretty high da damage numbers. I'm getting four, uh, 14,000 per hit. Oh, okay. On the low end. I'm getting 40,000 after concurrent. There we go, I got, I got a big hit. I had to hit the head for the big hit. Yeah, after... After the... After a couple hits, I'm doing about 80,000. Mm -hmm. First hit's doing 14. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's something up with my gun. I've delivered a life support capsule to the area. I'm probably gonna have to figure it out later. Also, apparently, um, the galvanized shot is not most effective on this. Apparently the Rando's still with us, but yet he's not in squad. That's weird. Yeah. That is very weird. He shows when you press the when you press the escape button, he still shows up. Oh. On the player menu. Your thing is tripping. Yeah. Oh, I'm coming. Ow. Oh, I went down too. There we go. Let me see if I can try the melee weapon. Oh, it's Sasuke. Sasuke Uchiha? Yeah. Life support has arrived. Say you're a weave without saying you're a weave. All okay. right. <laughs> Technicalities. This build's doing pretty decently for something I'm still kind of working on. Yeah. Fuck you, nullifiers. The, the best piece of biblical comedy. The person who hates nullifiers but always goes against uh, the corpus. <laughs> I know, that's the funny part. Yeah. It's like, you know, you could just skip the nullifiers and just not fight the corpus. Yeah, but then the game's too easy. Yeah, pretty much. It's kind of like, it's kind of like sucking at fighting dragons but still fighting the dragon because it's fun, you know? I hate dragons proceeds to fight dragons. Because <laughs> it's a Elden Ring in a nutshell. Yeah. Yeah, this this uh this melee weapon definitely is not not uh wrong in its uh, power. Nautilus might actually help up my frost a bit. Oh, okay. Hey, bye, Aber. Oh, bitch. Fuck over here. Ow. Very easy. Dead. <laughs> yeah, very easy. Dead. <laughs> He tried to fight me too. Motherfucker was like, "Fuck you," and I was like, "No, fuck you." Successful start. When you are ready, go to extraction. Yeah, you should probably pop a tower. 
We should probably stop the door, yeah. Yeah, I'm on it. Yo. I just noticed the timer. Yeah, I'm gonna come with you. I think it'd be a good idea. Randall go me on. Life support active. Yeah, I just saw a corpus fall to his doom. That's awesome. That's yeah, what he, he gets he, for working in a gas just, city. He just literally jumped off. Oh. Uh, they should have invested in anti-suicide nets. <laughs> He that's probably, probably that's probably the wrong that's probably the wrong joke to be using right now. <laughs> We're Nathaniel. <laughs> yeah. Actually, uh, oh no, I think April is the month that's probably like the worst month to get that make that joke. Or in some cases, it's probably like the perfect time, you know. <laughs> Actually, <laughs> like Christmas is the worst time for suiciding. Uh, yeah, I think, yeah, I think, I think the thing is like, uh, 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 April is su uh suicide awareness month, I think. So that's probably like yeah. why it's like the worst time to say something like that. But I'm like, I'm one of those people who really like fucked up comedy, like not not, not even dark, but like fucked up. And so I was somebody who probably would make that kind of joke. So I definitely would probably have to be watching it specifically on April. Especially since I think your rally is on there too. And you heard my theory about where your rally is. I don't think I don't think a frame that came out in April should have that theory. <laughs> I uh, remember. It's just a theory. A okay, game theory. theory. Ow. Oh, all these explosions. You know what I need? Energy. Energizing dash. Remember when energizing dash was a thing? Yeah. That, that was really interesting, because it was easy to use. But it also was kind of ass. But like, because of how easy it was to use, it was just that easy. And then they have the one that is now that increases your strength if you do it twice. And I'm like, the strength increase is usually like not really necessary, to be completely honest. Like if you actually need that in increase in damage, you're you're running into issues that I don't think you're not really necessary. doing enough damage to begin with. Yeah. But so I think it only adds up to like a five percent boost. Yeah, I think it's like a twenty percent boost. But then again, uh, if you if you have like a large amount of uh of strength already, it ends up being like about a 5% boost, mathematically speaking. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I have to say, for a build I'm still working on, this is doing pretty decently. Yeah. No man, every once in a while I'll get like really high numbers and, and and other times I'll get like absolutely shit numbers with this thing. That's why I say like inconsistent like math with this game. Yeah, that's a warframe. Yeah. Cause I I'll get like sixty I'll get like fifty thousand damage in a in a headshot, but it's like it just is usually like a headshot that is like Random. It's like a random headshot. Headshots, I'm getting about 14, but then again, I'm using Arcane dead, Deadhead. Yeah. Yeah, actually, if, if you're getting a headshot of uh, 15 with your headshots at uh, max, max stats on yours, then that means mine is actually isn't doing that bad. It's just that I'm not hitting the head enough. So maybe, so maybe my weapon actually isn't doing too bad. I'm just not yeah, just used. Just did a forty thousand. Yeah, I'm just not on used a to it. Yeah, I think it's what. It, oh, where the fuck did this guy go? We will oh, he's over there. Bounty. Hold out as long as you can. 
Where is he? Where's your dead body, sir? Oh, there he is. I'm using Nautilus. Oh, never mind. I was about to say where I'm using oh. Nautilus and he's not doing his sucky, but apparently it's just that he's down right now. Yeah, you can tell his build's not quite complete because Archie Acker never, hardly ever goes down. Yeah. But I think I might end up doing a Nautilus build for Frost. Yeah. Fucker! How dare you knock me over! No. There we go. Then nullifier with a with a guard dog. He's over here with a uh, what you call? What the fuck? Come here, bitch. Oh yeah, I forgot. Yeah, I can. I can. I add ammos. I can assassinate if I do a. Oh, but so for some reason, uh, at least because there's like a bunch of um, a bunch of little drones, but he keeps getting his shields back and he won't die. I forgot that I had my Atomos. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice. Yeah, Atomos. I built one. And then Karn in. Mm -hmm. Hundreds of thousands of damage. Actually, no, it's only hundreds of thousands of damage with certain things going going right for you. I know, the, I know if you go with pure crit, it can actually do a lot of damage as well. Actually, no, I, I think... I'm running a hybrid build right now. Yeah. I find that to be the most decent. Yeah. I think is how I have it built. Yeah. I don't remember. I'd have to actually look at my mods. Yeah. Hybrid is probably like the best way to go. Depends uh, on the weapon. Yeah. Definitely depends on the weapon. I, don't I mean, like, because it on. naturally has very low, uh, low status. Unless you have a certain handle type, it's best just to go with crit chance. Don't waste your time with a hybrid. Yeah. I think when it comes to hybrids with kit guns, it's more like a thing of like, uh, like it's gonna be a bullet hose anyway. So it's like it's gonna get yeah. it's ga it fully galvanized eventually, especially when it only takes a few hits to get those fully galvanized. So it's probably best to go like full crit. I made this one that was pure hybrid just because I thought it would be uh, interesting, but. I don't think uh, I don't think it's doing very well, so I'm gonna probably have to switch back to my other one, which I'm I'm glad I didn't pump too much into this. But I'm probably I didn't gonna even see what killed me. Uh, I think I think his I think he's the one with uh, well no he's not the one with the bubble. But I saw him swinging and all of a sudden you went down, so I'm assuming he slapped you across the face with his blade. Maybe. And also, the guy with the explosion. Uh, the man was dead. Yeah, Sasuke has like massive explosions for no reason. Oh yeah, actually, that's, a, that's uh, like he's a. Using a ogress. That that's actually a good thing to say for the anime too. You know, the anime is like this motherfucker has big flashy attacks, and it's like none of his big flashy attacks even work correctly. Like, he's taking down a couple of people, don't we get me wrong. Pop down a, pop a trophy. Yeah, they, but like... I'm popping a tower right now. Yeah, me too. But, like, Sasuke has taken out huge motherfuckers, don't get me wrong, but like, every single time it really, really matters, he loses. <laughs> it's usually when he uses like his biggest shit, right? Mm -hmm. And I guess it's because like he's not really the protagonist, but like... When Sasuke fights in uh, in the anime, he kind of sort of just has a bunch of fla uh, like, like yeah, it's like that. It's like his his um his flashiness is like for nothing, right? Yeah. 
And then apparently you got Naruto who... Even though he's like a guy who's had a shitty life and has, does a lot of hard work, he's a prodigy in hand-to-hand -hand combat. Yeah. So like, that's interesting. And, and except for when you see them fight against each other, you see that he's definitely holding back. Because he gets hit yeah. with shit you don't really see him get hit by. But if you, but I think I was watching like a, a, a an anime analytics guy who like analyzes anime, which is actually a thing. He's over here saying that like Naruto is a f it, uh, at the end of the anime is really fucking good yeah. at fighting. Naruto actually really holds back quite a bit during the anime. Yeah, like, he doesn't he necessarily want to so kill you, but one. He, yeah. Damn, that, that guy just would not go Especially down. Especially when he's against his friends. Yeah. Additional light not only like that, but he can... Maru, it's no yeah. remorse. But yeah. against Sasuke, for example, even though Sasuke is honestly trying to kill him, but Naruto, no, I'm holding back, because... Yeah. Dude, we went to school together. Yeah. Not, not only that, with the, with the whole flashy thing, he likes to do, like, these, these super... Like, he actually slip a lot of jutsu in this shit, but apparently it's it's been known that he has a really small amount of chakra. Yeah. So the fact that he's using such expensive jutsus is is actually bad for him. Which is interesting. But apparently that's like his biggest is supposedly his biggest weakness is that he spams a whole bunch of expensive shit. Like I think the first time he uses a fireball jutsu, afterwards he after he does that he's kind of sort of out of breath. If I remember correctly, I'm not sure if that's like accurate though. But I know that like know. he's usually out of breath when he's done using a bunch of jutsu. But they do shit. They do nothing. <laughs> they do shit. That's what I noticed about the anime. It's like it's really it's kind of funny. Uh, he's like the big edgy dude who has to be like the best, but literally he he has to do the fly some fancy shit, and all of a sudden, oh wow, that kind of like did nothing. Meanwhile, the the main character is doing like stuff that isn't even that flashy, and he's getting way more work done. Okay, the nope. show up. Yeah, you can do. It. Makes sense. Oh, it's fucking inks, dude! Let's beat the shit out of the woman. I mean, that's probably a bad way to say that, but let's beat her ass. Bad kitty. Is that a mag? It is a mag. I just realized that Sasuke is a mag. Like a regular, average mag. I'm coming. Uh, better help here. Okay, I'm coming. Oh, I got it! I, know, I, I did not get it. I thought it was on. I, I saw you slightly be, uh, behind me, but my character threw herself forward when she came out. I almost grabbed it. It happens. Yeah, it happens. It happens. That's all good. Yeah. This game is weird. Uh. Frosty boy. I would say this mag is doing pretty good. I was. I, I don't know why, but I was not expecting a mag to be doing very good. I guess it's because she's a starter frame, and I also don't like playing with mags. I mean, I like mag. I gotta actually redo my mag build. Yeah. I mean, I like gonna mag, do it, but redo like, you know. from scratch. Yeah. I think it's legitimately, I just don't know how to use her. I just, like, straight up admit that one. I'll also, be honest, after kind of building a decent build for her, she mm -hmm. has become kind of one of my most favorite frames. Mm I also found out that I can force a, uh, yeah, I can force a, uh, finisher attack with the dagger. Nice. Apparently they're also making it to where you can assassinate MOAs eventually. I'm not sure when they're doing that. But they said something along the lines of, like, uh, when you're doing stealth, when you're trying to be, uh, doing finishers, you can't do it on MOAs. So they're trying to make it so you can do it on MOAs. Yeah, MOAs a bit difficult because it's the head's not at the top of the body. 
So it's not like I could slit the neck of, let's say, a regular enemy. This thing is so much fucking damage. The thing is, is that it's built in sympathy for my melee Yorale. And I was actually thinking about showing people why it's specifically built the way it is. And the thing is, it has no crit damage mods, which is interesting. Yeah. And the reason is because that melee Yorale has three um, purple shards. On oh, many uh, damn yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. Guess a random amalgam group over here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Apparently this thing guarantees slash rocks, which, uh, I think, I think some people were like, we're, we're thinking that, like, uh, it won't be as good to just use, um, certain builds. But I'm over here, like, some weapons guarantee slash rocks. So, um, if you want to nuke against, um, Grenier, Maybe the problem isn't the fact that you're doing nuking against Grenier with a weapon that uses electricity. It's the fact that you're using the wrong one because it doesn't guarantee slash rocks. Because I've been able to nuke Grenier with this. And it's mostly because I've been using the slash the guaranteed slash rocks. Hello, Torment. Where are you? Go over there with. Yeah, he's on the mag. Come on, Sasuke. Awesome. Awesome. Oh my god! Where'd he go? There he is. She actually went into a corner to hide. Yeah, cause I froze her. She, does, she apparently does not like being inside of a, a bundle of explosions. Err, oh, yeah. There we go. Not a, oh yeah, here we go. It's, it's time. Another warning shot has activated. So... Yeah. Yeah, we got a new white night wave this time. I think once we hit 25, we should go. Sounds good. I'm just putting a message in chat for the rando. I guess I missed the Lindimator. What? That was good. Oh yeah, they have Exumus Eliminator for all of them. They decided to make it like with guaranteed things that you can get. Another life support capsule is now available. Do 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 do. What the fucker? I was about to finish him off with a hit, and he's got his shields back all of a sudden. What the fuck? Is there a slot open? Yeah, there's a slot open. This is just the the mag is just a a rando apparently. Rando Rambo. Ow. This is meta, and I'm like, of what aspect of gameplay? It's like, what? Shut up. <laughs> this is better. Oh. Oh, really? Cool. Right. Like, meta, meta is literally just like 
it's the easiest way to do something, but what it is you're trying to do is probably the thing that um, I'm worried about. It's like, how, how do you make a, a secondary really good? Oh, you literally use like hybrids. Like, oh, but like, which secondary you use? And I'm like, that's not the question, is it? <laughs> I think I, I did think of uh, a way I was uh, uh, thinking about explaining like uh, the difference between meta and the like what people say meta is. If you would say, oh, meta is take out the enemies as fast as possible, but I'm like, no, that's a gameplay no, aspect, that's right. and there's a meta way to do that. But like, it's not like the way that I prefer. Damn it, motherfucker! Look what our Tenno Come here! Just found. They could not do this fucking... without you. Come here. This this Eximus just keeps getting his shield oh, back. We just got 25 minutes. Oh, okay. It's probably the extraction. Aww. I just realized that myself. Yeah. The meta the is getting, dropping. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so, some people are. Say, some people say meta is is killing as fast as possible, but I see like it's. It's a act aspect of gameplay, and there's a meta way to do it. You know, yeah. like there's a meta way to survive and stuff like that. But here's the thing: meta means easy, and the easiest way to to nuke is AOE. And that's like the yeah, thing. Are you using single target? Yeah, if you're using if you're using single target, it's not the meta way to do it. But in most cases, it does way, way, way more damage. And it makes it look better too if you oh, can yeah, actually we, hit a target. Yeah, if you can make it hit a target. I, I know a lot of people. A lot of uh, there's a couple creators who are like, who are like, um, I'm sorry, but I can't aim, and I'm like, oh, that's unfortunate. Meanwhile, I'm over I here on Maraluna I kind of aiming. Do more of a, I kind of do more of a spread job myself. Yeah. Oh, nice. We <laughs> completed survival mission by doing 20 minutes. <laughs> oh, that's that's fun. Yeah. Big single target damage is why breach search is collective curse is good. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, that, that that's that's also another way. It's like you can make you can make breach surge happen. You know, really big giant single damage. And that's probably a good way to do oh, it. It's I like, got Teleria. It's definitely not the. Oh, holy shit. Ooh, oh man, hold on. Um, I'll be right back. <laughs> okay, do I? I kind of also be RB. I gotta go grab my uh... daughter. The beast must be the beast. Uh. Okay, let me see. Did my money come in yet? Come on! Yay! My Steam wallet is at seventy-three dollars. Hold on, bro. I just got Naros Invigorations, a thousand armor, and two hundred strength. Oh my god! <laughs> uh, thanks, game. Oh god, it's a single purchase, a single click purchase. I mean, ah, oh, there we go. Well, noises. Oh! <laughs> anyway, sorry, but yeah, I'm I'm pretty sure Brig is ready for the uh, uh Archon. That's probably what, probably what they're ready for. I'm ready for it too. Oh. Yeah. Hello. So it was Cupid, and and Brig. There we go. It's Brig. I sent Cupid an invite. There we go. There we go. I'm also going to put it on invite only. Yes and no, yeah. Like, look how they massacred my boy. Bye. Let's see. God damn it. No. Uh, oh, Jazz? Yeah, what's up? There we go. I was just checking who it was. Who's it? You, uh, you sound like terrifying Tessa, but tired. 
Uh, yeah, it's because I've been fucking, uh, mm. I can't word this without being fucking TMI. Uh, uh smoking a lot of weed? No, I had to visit my toilet more than I've been visiting my mom. Oh, yeah, I forgot. You, you're, you're sick. Yeah, it fucking sucks. As yeah. a fat and spicy food do not mix well. Holy shit. <laughs> but fucking love it... a spicy food, but I do agree. Oh, trust me, I love fucking spicy food. It's just, holy shit, am I in pain right now. Mm-hmm. Oop. So I need convulsion. I need that. What's next? Uh, I would join, but I'm in Fortuna right now. Yeah. Oh yeah, did you manage to do the mission or no? Uh, the wave yeah. finder mission. Yeah, yeah, I I've had that finished. So oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. I'm just trying to get my own fucking K drive at this point. Yeah. Hey, hey hello there, dudes. Yo, just let's see. What am I missing? I'm missing something. I'm missing... Hollow point. There we go. Hollow point. What's this? Hey, Two figure roller key. I am going to completely redo my mag. Uh, I think you want to keep that, actually. That looks like a good ribbon. What ribbon is it? It's a tomb finger ribbon with heat. Oh, wait, no. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I don't think you want to go with a flare build with that. You want to go with a viral and build, a viral and hemorrhage. So I think you should probably roll that and see if you can get critical and critical. Too critical. Damage and, yeah. and, and chance. Yeah, because... I don't know. Hey, Gizmo. Okay, I got my radiation and cold ready to boop. Um, I wonder how easy it is to hit her in the face. So I'm going to see if I can get primary deadhead on here. A secondary deadhead on here. Here, I'm going to use the latum. And I'm gonna be I'm gonna get my Yurali. Where's my Yurali? Yaraba. Yaraba. Oh my god, I just realized something. I actually just realized something, so How I'm very slots I, are, are taken up right now. Because for oh. me it still says we have the uh Plyso hurt guy. Yeah, apparently yours is busted because we have other people here. <laughs> Yeah, I know. We we have uh, Bucci Cat. I can see Bucci Cat. But we also we also have um, Cupid here too. Okay. Yeah, apparently mine's busted. Yeah, Hang on. Is I'm busted. gonna leave squad. Just reinvite me. Yeah, hold on. Reinvite. Oh, like yeah, that's bomb. weird. That is very. That was very weird. Y'all. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I ca I kind of want to use this here, Rani, because she has Eclipse. And, yeah, I want to try this. I want to try this. Hold on. 20%. Oh, no. Gotta use... What's it called? 
Gotta use... What, what's the one that gives a lot of crit? I think it's called Slap. Or Spank. Something like that. Oh, or also, uh, kill, kill, kill something. Uh, kill stream. Kill stream is better because it's faster reload in exchange for a lower amount of ammo. But it also uses less, um, less rare stuff for it as well. Oh, are you talking kit gun stuff? Yeah, kit gun stuff. Yeah, so I we need just rescue and defense. Good. Defense? Ah! Oh. Oh, I see. Yeah, I don't have much standing with them, so I'm going for a basic um, beam weapon secondary. Mm hmm. Yeah, this is actually really good. Like, to give you an idea, Jazz, I built my first kick gun when I was rank 3 with them. Yeah, they have no ranking with them. He has no ranking. They have. They have no ranking. Hello, woman. Greetings, woman. You're clipping. My woman is clipping, guys. Her thighs are too big for her outfit. Damn. Mhm. Mm she may have a flat thighs. ass, but she does have them thighs, which I'm appreciative of. So you do have Sorry, forgive thighs. me. I'm kind of putting together a new mag build. Mag. Mag. Yes, a mag prime build. Mm hmm. <laughs> Do 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 okay. Oh my god dude you, you know how you know how you ever, ever seen that meme of like somebody saying hey dad why is there uh, was everything uh it was it like why is everything you you had as a kid scary and he's over here like everything we had as a kid scary was scary. And I was thinking like the Teddy Tubbies are actually kind of scary if you really think about it. But when we were little, that was like normal. The Teddy Tubbies are like the hella normal shit to to people my age. I think like like everybody in this call as well on the stream that are like all the co-stars in the star, we're all old enough to remember the Teddy Tubbies. Potatoes were awesome. So, I have no clue how well this mech build is gonna work. Do you say nipple? Most migration. Uh... I have nipple idea. Oh, yeah, okay. Mm, maybe. Apparently everybody's on my internet? I think so. Yeah. Or Cupid, I'm not sure. I wish I could check. No, uh, we'll see, I guess. Yeah. I think Cupid's the host. Cupid's on the left for me. Yeah. Yeah, Cupid's the host. You're player two, I'm player three. Okay. Our targets in condition. Yeah, you're probably closer to Cupid. Do what you can. Bring yeah, I'm player two. Yeah. And the blind worm deemed the scream. To be madness. You know, I haven't used my brand, brand vandal in a while. Yeah. It's probably a perfect place to bring it to, because incarnate weapons are the Archon killers, I guess. Hell yeah. I saw somebody oh, using the Inch Prisma Angstrom against the Archons of all things, and I was like, I should try that. I never tried it though, it. unfortunately. I should end up actually making it. Yeah. Well, the Prisma Ancient has to come from Barrow, which is unfortunate. Yeah, I know. So does the Prisma Scana. Yeah. 
Pretty much Ghana is actually probably pretty good too. I think somebody was saying oh, like, if, if only they could get a hold of a pri uh, prisoner Angstrom. And, and I was like, hee hee hee, this, this is a good point. And, <laughs> Because they, they were they they really wanted to use the Pringsma Angstrom for your rally apparently, because it was my incarnates for your rally uh, video. Oh shit! Uh oh, oh. You fell to your doom. Yeah, I did. I jumped the wrong way. There we go. I hate that. One of the things about Gas City, I hate. Don't mind me, I failed my doom. Yeah. Whenever That's you get ready, whenever yeah. you get good enough to use your ready on uh, the gas city, you know you're Korea. the man. You are running out of but time. then again, you still run into issues. Stay focused. There's a heavy unit approaching. The bypass is done. Holy Go. shit! Bypass is done. Yeah, that I is almost. Fun. My... It has the feeding. Oh, that's that one's empty, I think. Oh, there we go. I found a man. Thank you. Oh shit! Oops. This guy's weird. No, I'm not gonna give you an extra weapon. Is he? You don't cost enough. Yeah. Plus, you're too dumb to figure out how to use the kunai. Yum. Inaro's rework is exciting. You're already augmented is exciting. Oh, and, and her new helmet, too. I'm actually considering having this you already have the alternative helmet. But I'm not sure if I should or not. You're gonna buy it. I'm gonna get the skin just for the simple factor of supporting your rally. Yeah. The thing is, is uh, I'm not the, skin gonna use it. the skin doesn't come up until uh, next update. This next, this next one coming up is like, oh no, the update after this one, sorry. Update after this one. But she's gonna come up with a new helmet, and the helmet is pretty cool. What is this? What's happening? Oh, there. <laughs> it, it brought me into some bullshit. Let me see. Okay, we need defense. We need to defend the man. Actually, we need... We need to bring defender, defend like stuff that's really good in defense. So we have to do that. Latum has leveled up. That's cool. But I need to swap this for a beam weapon. I hate how we got defense three times in a row. Oh yeah, this is my melee. I just realized that this is my melee rally when I just. Well, I think I did. I, I forgot that it was, and then I remembered again. I think that's what happened. Ugh. <laughs> Boop. You guys talk to PC. Oh, okay. Okay, let's see. Let's uh turn this off. There we go. I'm running my Neja. No. Let's see. Who has the invigorations this week? Oh, cool. Secondary crit chance plus a thousand armor or Neja. Mm. We'll go with that. What do we have today? 
Oh, uh, we got Titani, uh, Trinity, Steinax, and Rhino. I got Neja, Varuna, and Grendel. Mm -hmm. The invigoration for Steinax is literally what I want for your relic. Mm -hmm. I have an override ready if I if I need to. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Oh, there we go. And I got my standing next for. All right, hit my. All right, let's get. Kids for today. Yay. Oh. Mr. Fodder 5. <laughs> Mr. Fodder 5. Nice. Post migration again. How did that happen again? What is know. happening? Uh, apparently, Bucci is the host. What? Oh, or am I the host? Bucci's gone. No. She's in. She's the host. I'm player two. Mm. Oh, never mind. It's Cupid. Oh, never mind. There we go. What? What is happening? I'm on top of the thing now. This game is weird sometimes. The power of Butchie Cat's um, PC is that she's host now. He's host now. I'm not sure. Yeah, they're host now. Mr. Father 1 is better than 5. Yeah. Yeah. We gotta have a babysitter for him. How's it going? <laughs> Lead on, mighty. How's it going? Yeah, it's this guy. Yeah, I gave him a halo, so he should have a little bit of defense. Yeah. We have Citrine too, so we should be able to heal him over time, as long as we get enough uh, health orbs. We yeah, did I'm gonna be redoing him. my Horus pretty soon. Because I have a new build idea that I want to try. Mm -hmm. It's funny, she's my favorite frame, but she can't last too well in Steel Path. Yeah. At least without, you know, Venari Bodyguard. Mm -hmm. Which I think is kind of cheating. Yeah. Yes, that's kind of a spiel of her, but still, I feel like it's kind of cheating. Yeah. But, whatever. He still has a halo, so he's good. Mm -hmm. He's not gonna take any damage until the halo's gone. Mm -hmm. Halo right now is, uh... I actually can't see how much health it has. When it got cheating, yeah. yeah oh, I think they it's exploiting. Yeah, then again, I also rely on that for Dagoth, too. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. It's just a simple factor that I kind of need to build a much buffer for, uh, mm -hmm. per se. I never do whip claw builds though. I find them boring as fuck because you only use one bit, one ability. Yeah. We are the most anti-meta motherfuckers in 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 the history of gaming. Well, I've seen worse. I've seen people be inappropriate with it. You're not likely to get mercy from someone who's never been shown it. Now, are you? Yeah, that is yeah, very questionable. Yeah, I know, because that... It, 
it kind of removes your entire... In my opinion, Nari gives a lot of versatility to Korra. Because she's able to heal, she's able to recover a lot. Like, she's able to multitask. Multitasking is correct. Yeah. Oh my god, I've seen somebody do that, by the way. I saw somebody subsume Razor Ring off of Tatsani, and I was like, what the fuck, are you stupid? And he said something along the lines like, I can't keep up the energy, and I'm like, can't. And then my brain was like, you realize you can get energy if you kill a lot, right? What, what weapon, like, what is your, what is your Dex Pixie ability? And he's over here like, uh... He, I think it was like... What are the Dex Pixia? And I'm like, what? <laughs> like, what's a Dex Pixia? And I'm like, what the fuck you mean, what's a Dex Pixia? That's her. That's literally Titania's weapon. Yeah, he still has the Halo, but he's receiving a bit of damage right now. Mm -hmm. I'm watching him. We need to somehow get a hold of more health orbs for the train. Well, we have 90% damage reduction plus another 90%. Well, okay, Bucci doesn't have another 90%. Yeah, no more. So I can give you guys damage. more damage reduction. Yeah. Above the Lord's there you go. Below my people. I gave Buji with Cat even more damage reduction. Yours. And I, I shall serve as shepherd and minister. I remember one time I was playing Neja, mm -hmm. and I made somebody ship themselves, and I cast in safeguard on them. I'm like, what the fuck? You can chair the Halo? Yeah. I just grabbed my hands. <laughs> I'm gonna shit myself. <laughs> Oh my god, he has died! That is him. unfortunate. Get up, sir. He's alive. He lives! He lives! He lives! It's alive! Oh. Sorry, I had to. I wish- I wish you was- hacker? How did you go down? I wish the defense mission was five rounds. Yeah, instead of ten. Yeah. Oh shit. They lowered the amount of, um, uh, what you call they had to do, the, uh, other one. But they didn't lower the defense missions. I think they did. Oh, how did he die with that much damage reduction? Uh, probably got uh, rushed by a few things. Yeah, he got, he got rushed by quite a few. I had to take a, a good squad of enemies. Yeah. Yeah, he needs a babysitter. I might see if I can help. Oh yeah, yeah, he needs a babysitter. There's a motherfucker right there. Safe space. No, I think uh, safe space would be uh frost. We saw frost makes a whole entire oh, bubble, yeah. safety bubble. Yeah, she's talking about safeguard. Yeah, I was, I, I, no, I, was, I was actually over here making a joke about it, but I was like, I'm over here thinking, wait a minute, that wouldn't work. His frost would be safe space. They're over here like, I will make a bubble around you, and then you can literally just sit there in a snowy bubble, drinking hot cocoa, in a blankie. I saw someone make a... Uh, I saw somebody make a little comic about that that included some gameplay. It's like when you forget that, yeah, it's like when you forget that you have a uh, new player with you or something like that. And it was like they're over here drinking hot cocoa with their frost inside of a blankie, 
and the new player is freaking the hell out trying to survive. Like, uh, did we forget yeah. something? <laughs> See, the only issue I have with my Neja is I have too much energy. Yeah. I recover it too fast and I can't spend it enough. Keep in mind, I'm running minus efficiency with this too. <laughs> yeah. Like Sectacality is cast one safeguard, it costs me 200 energy. Mm -hmm. By the time it's cast, I'm already recovered fully. Yeah. <laughs> that guy's bad. I have too much. Let's see. I have reached the, uh, the moment of sleepy. Ah! I've reached sleepy status. Okay. Oi. Oh shit! How did he die? I could have swore he was right. Uh, oh, no, no. I'm on him. He got rushed. Yeah. On my screen, he was over here. Oh, on my screen, he isn't necessarily moving that much. Or maybe he jumped down there when I wasn't looking and just got he got surrounded. That usually happens. Yeah, sometimes. he got. That's what happened. Uh, he jumped down into a squad of enemies. Damn, this dude's an idiot. <laughs> Like, dude, you, you, you need to not. Also, we need to, uh, Brig is right, uh, Butch gets right. We need to, um, save, um, we need to save the Netra cells for the update. Yeah. So don't, so, but as a quick piece of advice for today, or if you watch this past tense, do not... Do the Netra cells until when the update comes out, or maybe a little bit later. Wait, wait until like Saturday or something. Chipper's down. Chipper, you chippy. I got him. Oh shit. It's like. Turn your back on him for one second, he'll fucking dive himself into a bunch of assholes. What is this? Oh, he's about to dance. I'm, I'm a cat. I'm a kitty cat. And it does sense, and I got The only person to make official artwork for your rally was a guy named Trash Waifu. And I'm over here like, okay. So, does that mean you just like really like trash waifus? It's like, apparently, yeah. During that person made. It was like trash waifu, and he's over here like making official artwork for him because, you know, a fan of trash waifus. I'm like, cool. Why does he have to say things that specifically is about sexy things? You know, you, you know, like the the lore of the harpy and the lore of the uh, the um, gorgon is the fact that they're really, really hot, and that's how they get their prey. Is he? Is he? If he's is he backhandedly saying that his sister is hot? I don't know, man. 
That's just how I see it. I may probably be reading in too much into it. <laughs> I think so too. Yeah. Uh, 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 let's see. Let's go. I'm gonna go. Now to annihilate the icon. Annihilation. Oh, cool. I got rewards for Nightwave. Light, um... What did I get? What did I get? Nightwave credits! Cool! No. Uh, I can afford nothing. Oh shit, credits! I got more, I got more, I was... yeah, I got even more. Any more? Yeah, I got even more. Oh shit, I got five, nice. Oh, I got six? Oh my god, that... Okay, wait. Um, seven? What? What is happening? Oh. Nora okay, here we go. Let's go create offerings. What do you have for me? Working to lift us up. Uh, Citrine's alternate helmet. Cool. Titania's ultimate helmet. What is this? The ancient? Oh, this is a scroll for uh, K Drive. Hmm. And I think. Hey. Oh, Heat Sword. Oh, I mastered this already. Skull shots, double tap, deceptive bond. Okay, we're good. Ta ta, lovelies. I got nothing of interest. Nothing of interest. Damage reduct. I remember when I used to. The first time I watched. Uh oh. Uh, host left? Uh. That was weird. That was weird. Oh, you're the host now. Yeah, I know. Mm, Warframe go burr? Yeah, that was weird. Yeah, I might, we, we might need to swap. So let me invite everybody back. What you got? Yakados. Cupid. Yeah, I don't think I have Cupid on my friends list. I should probably add him. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It just it just re it just re it just host migrated again. We want we got one. I got two. But you cat is next. Yeah, just kind of. That was weird. Mm -hmm. Gucci cat. Meow. There we go. Look out. He's a nya the bitch. Nya. Uh, who's it? A uh, what's it? Not a uh, who's it. I think a what's it. That's around my dark princess. <laughs> In case you ask, that's my Dagoth build. Oh, nice. Yeah, I can armor strip. Mm. The naked princess. <laughs> naked princess and her haunts. Yes. Where is the kind? Hey, kitty. My cat has stirred. She's about ready to hop on my shit. Who whispered dreams of dominion into Speaking of which, I'm kind of hoping I don't have to work Who this Saturday because I got Friday off. Yeah. Confusion. Feel stupid to have have to work and then have the next day off and then. Come into work the following day and then have the next day off. Yeah. Again. Yeah. 
Here we go. Boing. Full incarnation. The funny thing is, I've never actually tested this uh, kick gun against a a uh, what you call it, Archon. Mm -hmm. So I have no idea how well this is going to do. Mm -hmm. I have only one weapon with me. I can't waste the incarnate. You found her. Stay on the move. Those eyes can kill. Yay! Oh, she can go over these now. has barred the way to us heathens, but stolen deacon veils should allow you to deceive the barrier. All right. She beat me. Oh, yeah, I'm not. Oh, yeah, you have, uh, yeah, it's not updated yet, so Eclipse needs to be in light to work. I don't yep. think my Eclipse was working when I was hitting her with the face. <laughs> uh, I'm coming. Well, at least it, it wasn't doing the thing I wanted it to do. That's what was happening. Ow. Fazul preaches of Tau, where once the great beasts held dominion, but none have seen Tau in centuries. I don't know, I still find it funny that Warframe does many updates Nine to their engine, mm -hmm. and yet it still runs on a potato machine. Yeah. Like, you look at how good Warframe looks, and it doesn't really require oh, that you bitch. powerful of a machine to run. Yeah, she decided to go invincible. That gun. Uh, I can't armor strip her anymore. Hey, well. There we go. Head short. She ah. knocked me over. You dealt with Archon Naira expertly, Tenno. Her kind may expect no mercy, no redemption. They can expect no, no, no nookie, nor cookie. So the question is, what did we get? Tau Forge or non Tau Forge? And the winner is... And... I got normal. Yeah, regular. Did anybody else get a Tau Forge? Or did we all get regular today? Oh, we got a Zal Ribbon mod. Are you saying something, game? Yes, you need to make us all. Yeah. Regular? Okay. Mm -hmm. Alright, what's the plan now? Uh, I guess I'll call for my audience and see if one of them wants to join us for one more. If not, I'll probably end it for today. Oh. I'm not going to do a video today, but I am planning a video for Wednesday when I get your ready's all grant. And unfortunately, it is going to be your ready video, which is going to make me seem a little bit crazy. But it's literally the only thing I planned. So I'm also going to do a secondary. So that would be great. Uh, but yeah, if you guys want to join for a sec, 
a second Archon, let me know. And I'll get you in here. Let's see, what's this? Have a good night, Cupid. Good night, Cupid. Mm, what's this? You check Tashin and stuff? Yeah, I think that would be probably a good idea. Actually, yeah, let's, let's do that. Let's go te check Tashin specifically. Tashin might have something interesting to say. Yeah, I was gonna get. I was gonna give everybody a bonus. Remember, I'm a legendary one. Yeah. Bye, butchie guy. Um, I gotta level up my mag. Yeah. So they just tossed a new form into her. Mm -hmm. I have no Archon shards in her right now. Yeah. It looks like it looks like some people showed up, so I could probably ask again. But if you want to do an Archon, I have one more in me before. Before I'm done. Uh, it's got defense today, so that means we're probably gonna have only one more in me because... Oh my god. Defense. Oh no, this is the wrong place. Tashin. Tashin, what do you got? Also make sure to do cow missions. Oh, your update for Netrocell. Because um, it's going to include yeah, I... updates to the Nitro Cells itself. But yes. the Nitro Cells can only it's be like done it... five times a week. So if you, yes. you do yeah, if you do them now... It's not going to... Yeah. They already confirmed that it's not going to reset your timer. Yeah. So to do the harder Nitro Cells, as I'm calling them right now, uh, you take two of your Nitro Cell counts. Now this means you get double the rewards and higher chance on getting the rare rewards... But keep in mind, it takes two. Mm-hmm. Ishamo helmet. Eight. I was right. It does make the lady look fat, too. Why you gotta make armor that makes us look fat? I mean, it gives us a fat ass. Like, nice ba -donk -ba -donk butt, but... I don't know. Oh, wait, no. This is the operator. Well, no, that's not the operator. Hmm. Oh, it is the operator. This is the operator. This is the operator. What's... Okay, yeah, never mind. I take back what I said. Hmm, let's see. I should grab Kuva. <laughs> Kuva. Restored an affinity blessing. For leveling. Okay. Uh Trio Orbit Ephemera Counterbalance. Attention has not that much good stuff. Last place. Yeah, the Riven Cipher though. Yeah. Riven Cipher is good. It's the best thing he has right now. But I'm not into shotguns. Well, I'm not into giving shot uh, shotguns in to a point where I want to do a thing. Two melee, one pistol, yeah. I think everybody's like AFK in this relay. Yeah, they're all just chilling. Normally, I get at least one comment immediately. Like, like what blessing do you guys want? Thing. Crickets. Yeah. Yeah, let's see. Hey, right, I'm gonna be our beat. Oh, a a critis? A Critus. Hmm. You want to do some Dubury with me? Uh, I don't know. I, I actually might be done with the stream today. I'm just checking some stuff. Um, I might be done with the stream today. That's really what I'm doing. Uh, but I might be able to play later off of stream. Duvery sounds like a good idea sometime. I might, um... Yeah, I, I've been planning on doing, uh... Some stuff. I've been planning on doing... What you call? Uh, uh hanging out in the, uh... Damn it! 
shotgun mod hanging out in the place. What is it called? I forget what it's called, my bad. Uh oh, hanging out in a general chat and talking to some subscribers, maybe. Probably. I'll probably do that later. To quote another. Oh what? We have that today? And courage on my I did not know that. I, can't I actually had pushed, no idea. But never pushed. Befriended, but never Changed juice. Coerced. Oh, you went to come see what Killed, was up. But never shamed. Here's to you, dreamers. That's a pink ass. Pink ass, what you call? Wukong. That's the pinkest Wukong I've ever seen. It's pink as fuck. Alright. <coughs> so. I'm gonna end it here. I have no plans. Uh, so, um, I don't know, I do have plans. I'm planning on a video tomorrow, uh, on Wednesday. I might actually do it after our exercise day on Tuesday, or maybe Monday, depending on the situation. Oh, no, 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 I can't do it like that, because I have to wait for the augment. Okay, I'll wait for the augment, do a video then. So I hope you have wonderful, wonderful nightmares. I will see you in them. And remember, if you're watching my content, I know you're into it. Honey, honey. Mwah. Good night. Alright, time to go to bed. Ah! Oh, speaking of going to bed, I can't go to bed without using some, uh, lotion. <laughs> Good night. <laughs>